wrong with it. What up, Gabe? Come on with it. Just trying to set things up. We're on a little bit late. All right, we in business. Davis, what up? Sharbuckles, what's up, dude? Somebody want to join me? Show me something. Show me what's going on with your fish tank. Hot ashes, what up? Carlos, click clack, what's good? Just got home from work. Figured I'd do some streaming. Shy Town, what's up, buddy? Anybody want to jump in and show some reef tanks? I got some fish in my reef tank. Convents of you guys. Um, when we streamed the other night, you guys are like, just throw these fish in there. Uh, so I threw them fish in there. Barrier reefs, what up, G? I work a little bit, a little something, something. How you doing, Bay Area? I ain't seen you since, uh, I ain't really talked to you in a while. You're in the stream a couple weeks ago, but what's good, my G? <clears throat> Somebody want to come in and show me a reef tank? Come on, man. I hate streaming alone. Good, working a lot. I hope that side works keeping you fed, bro. Nice, Clack. Um, I broke my pump. I don't know if you heard the other night. I think I was talking about was it? I don't know. Either way, my pump's like super loud. And so I talked to people who were like, yo, just take it apart, see if the impeller is working properly. And I did, and putting it back together, I cracked it, like the inlet to screw the pump onto the actual reactor. So I reached out to BRS, and they got back to me right away. I, I replied, they replied this morning, and I replied again. So they're like, oh, it's, you know, they're noisy for a little while. It's just the pump trying to get the air out of there and that's what i thought too and then like 24 or 48 hours i ran it for more than two days and it was still sounded like a hang on the back filter before it like catches so i don't know i told him can we do anything about this because on your site pumps are like 115 bucks and you don't even have the one that i have i mean you have the i bought the reactor from you you have other pumps but not the model that i have so I don't know. We'll see. I hope they don't say, oh, it's user error. But in my opinion, I shouldn't have to take something apart to try and fix it. So we'll see. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what the deal is. We will find out. Hopefully tomorrow. They Maybe they'll uh, email me back tomorrow. Sherry, what's up? Mike, is you in the washer? Yeah, I didn't do it, though. Can, uh, can you take it out for me? Can you, uh, Turn it on? hold on. Clack, you're going crazy with this fish tank, huh? I'm thinking about putting the T5s over mine for now. Because I want to put I'm gonna put this coral in there. So I might just throw the T5s in there until I figure out how to mount these damn AIs. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna make a canopy. I bought some stuff on Sunday to make a canopy. What's up, Nano Man? How are you, buddy? 
So I bought the some wood on Sunday and I bought some I didn't buy like I don't know. I bought like little I don't think they're two by twos. I think they're smaller than that. And then I bought like uh some really thin plywood, a four by four sheet, two of them. So I'm gonna try and make it a little lighter. Um and figure out some kind of like rail system or bracket or something for the AIs. I still need to buy one more AI. So we will see what's up. I got nice chi Uh so I got the four bulb T5 from before. I think I might just throw it up there just to get these corals. I want to take I want to get the coral out of the 28, put it in the the new tank and break that little tank down. I, I don't like that tank. And there's I had to do some fucanazole like five days ago because I didn't even realize there's hair algae in there. That's just neglect. Uh, you know, I'll chalk that up as my fault. Um, but I want to get that out of there. Yesterday I went in there and I tried to manually remove some of the green hair algae while because it was just on the sand bed. Weird. Um, but I drained the tank almost all the way down, took all the rocks out, and finally got the fish out. I got the two clowns, the damsel and my yellow watchman my little homie i got them out put them in the new tank acclimated um i made an impulse buy and bought a couple rasses little baby rasses did like an hour acclimation on both of them and put them in so i probably put too many in there but whatever it happens nano man what up my dude what up buddy what if i can hear you can you hear me uh oh. I don't know. Can we see this new tag? I don't know what the problem is. Uh oh. Uh oh. Um, I need to put a video out, Gabe. I don't want to go out there. I got. I live in a. Yeah, don't worry. About house it. with few of us, God, and there's people PC. out there. I don't want to like go out and. He can't hear me. Be talking. Somebody's <laughs> watching TV. I can hear. I just, it'll be too loud. That's why I'm usually streaming. And there's nothing to see on my end. I could go out there. Just turn off the volume, I guess. Uh, if Nano's talking, I can't hear you. Um, Jesus, this is so stupid. Stupid. So, unless that was him, because he just left. So, let me see if I post the link, if I jump in on mine. My Lennon. Can you hear? Yo, what up, dude? Let me try to fix this. You get that meat and throw it away. Yeah, it says that you're in here with me right now, but it's not showing on. What am I doing here? So if I turn this down. How about now? How did I do this last time? All right, we should be good. Sorry, guys. Come on in with it. I don't know why I have to do this. All right, go ahead, guys. If you want to come in, try it now. That should be straight. I think you guys can hear me. Yeah, should be. There you go. Mikey, can you hear me? I can. I don't know what is wrong. Why? I don't, so there's got to be like a setting that's messed up on my laptop because I couldn't hear you a minute ago. I couldn't hear. Oh, I bet you got to go into your settings and then switch your playback uh, on device. What? Maybe. I don't on know. That's what, weird. Though? I don't know how those Mac Pros work. I don't know how those settings work on those. 
What's up, man? Not much. What's up, dude? Got full days worth of work. <laughs> yeah, me too. I worked. Uh, I mean, so today was my late day. I went in at ten, but I got out at eight. I drama. What's up, dude? So what I'm doing right now is I'm actually got the video for my laptop working and the volume for my cell phone next to me. Oh, okay. So that's what I got to, I guess I, that's what I got to do, I guess. So what are you doing, man? How's your uh, 75 going? Loving it, dude. You, what's going on with it? You want to show us? Yeah. Here, let me, uh, let me grab these glasses. Cause the blue lights all, screw, you know, you know how it is. Yep. <clears throat> Let's see. All right, Bobby, in a minute. All right, I want to present you real quick. All right. So, I mean, it's the same. My egg hands are coming out. You already got coral in there, huh? Hell yeah. The little uh, hammer here. You said you're going to go T5s. Why don't you get the... I'm thinking uh, about it. Right here, bud. Get the aquatic life and put your AI primes right in the middle. Dad, why are you on That's a high yeah. 26 right there. What did that cost you, though, for that for that setup? So with the bulbs and the uh, the whole fixture, it was like 450 I spent that on... But no, I'm, I'm already into my lights for. Yeah, it was. Uh, it kind of set me back a couple weeks. <laughs> so how long you been cycling? Because you're like right with me, right? Yeah, I'm probably a little bit less, but I put some uh, turbo start in there. I've got a pretty bad uh, b- uh, bacteria bloom. See how cloudy it is? Yeah, mine was too. Mine, mine's almost gone. I've been checking it every day. I already did a water change on it. I thought about it, but. I, I haven't done it yet. I don't know. I got like 60 gallons of RO in the basement, so I could. Yeah, I just did a small one. I just did, a, I think, 15 gallons is what I did. Yeah, I was thinking about just running like a 20. Yeah. I, um, yeah, so on Sunday, I because I ended up, I had sun off, and I ended up taking Monday off just because I haven't really had a day off in like four right. weeks, a little over four weeks, like a, a true day off. So I ended up putting four fish. I couldn't get the little, um, I can never think about what it is. It's a little, yeah. uh, I, I, either way, it's like, a, it's like, a, it's not a pseudo but something like one of those little guys. Either way, I, he, he hit the rock. I couldn't find him. So I got three, four fish in. And yesterday I went to a fish store and I grabbed a McCosker's wrasse, like a tiny uh-huh. little one and a tiny little six line. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, and I and I acclimated them last night, threw them in. So like, I was kind of worried about maybe like a uh, some kind of bacteria bloom, but everything seems fine. Yeah, that's cool. Those six lines are good. I don't see any. I don't see anything wrong with anybody. So I had a six line before, but um, he was actually really cool. Started being a bully towards the end, but he, he's yeah. fine. Hey, so the uh, Oscar isn't uh, doing that well. Out. Like, so you know, like how refroids works, right? It's like that powder. Yeah, yeah, I, I used to use it. Huh? I said I used to use it. I, I still have I was some. I'm wondering somewhere. about this. I don't know if anybody in the chat. Yeah, hey, Gage, keep it down, bud. If they would have any insight on this, but check this out. So, um, I was feeding my fish like this. I got some really nice flake food for them. And uh, I was like, damn, I wish I could feed my egg can, you know? Yep. So, oh, dude, I grinded this stuff up. It's my coffee grinder. And I swear to God, dude, it looks just like Refroids. What is it? And it's got, like, the same nutrition stuff in this as Refroids. And I just, I mushed it up and I fed my corals with it. <laughs> I mean, they'll, they'll eat anything, really, right? Yeah, I'm wondering if uh, if there's anything bad in flake food that, that I shouldn't do that with. What makes Refroid so damn special, though? You know what I mean? Probably because you don't have to grind it up, I guess. Yeah. For convenience. Well, shit, you coffee grinder it takes five seconds. Yeah, you're right. 
I was thinking about um, – I was watching Travis's video the other day about making fish food. It kind of seems like a good idea. Just get a, make a bunch of it so I have it for a long time. Even if I've got to spend like 50 bucks, uh, you know, off the start to do it. Right. We'll, we'll see. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I don't want to hurt my coral or anything. But, I mean, Refoids is like, what, 25 bucks for that thing? And I don't know. I had a little uh, – I got that little sample jar in a – in a uh, – uh, my aquarium box a while ago and uh-huh. I don't, I use it to like, um, I, well, I haven't used it in a while, but I used to use it like as prescribed, if you will. Um, and I it, do it, it, use it for, I use it for like three months and barely put a dent in that tiny little jar. Really? Yeah. So I don't know. And I saw Billy got from Polyp Lab like this big jar of it. So it's probably going to last like forever, dude. Nice. Hell yeah. Unless you dude. Keep it heavily. I don't know. I think I'm going to get a torch next. I think I'm going to spend like a hundred bucks on a coral. Get a nice one. (laughs) I think the most I ever spent was like, I don't know, 40 bucks on a coral. I'm scared to spend a lot, dude. I don't know why, but I am. But I want the thing with these 75s. It's like, you got to buy big if you really want to start filling it up though. You know, Yeah, I'm not worried about that. Like I'll I'll take time. What's up? Hell free. Yeah. I mean, I'm definitely going to, that's going to take time with some stuff, but I don't know. I kind of want something big in there now. I like those Lobos too. Uh Uh-huh. Those Lobo, uh, whatever they're, I think they're called Lobos. Yeah, I was at this fish store in, um, yeah, see, Pelfrey says, I've been using a small jar of reef for, uh, for my aquarium, for my aquarium, me too, for like two years now, still using it. Pelfrey, is it the little, like, little oh, jar? Because yeah. I I haven't used it in a while, but I use that thing probably like four months and barely put a dent in it. Like the nano jar? Yeah, that little, like, sample. I still yeah. have half of it somewhere. It might even be next to me. I don't know. I always mix too much up in my syringe. I always like throw, have to throw half of it out. Yeah. I um I I bought so I went to Fisher yesterday. I ended up getting um the McCoskers, the six line, and like nice. I popped and dropped basically, but um they run they run copper in their systems. And, okay. Like, I didn't see anything wrong with any of their fish. Like they don't have a huge selection. It's it's nice selection, not huge, right? But nice. Um and the two fish that I had bought had been in there for um one was in there for 10 days and one was in there for just seven. Oh, okay. So did, did you put them in your big tank? I did. Nice. Hell yeah, dude. But the McCosker's not doing well. I saw him. So he was like laying in the corner. You, he's breathing, laying there. I saw him like get up, swim away, grab a piece of food and go right back to the little spot and lay down. Uh-huh. Um, so to, to when I just got home just now earlier, I uh, went and looked at him and he's in a different spot, but just laying there. So I don't know. What What is he called? He's a McCosker's ras. McCosker's ras. I'd have to look yeah. that up. I don't he's, know. Like, he's only like he's like he's tiny. He's only like an inch inch big. He's, which he's I, probably actually, just scared. He'll he'll come around. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if any but someone was like picking on him last night. Now he's like scared, but I don't know. <laughs> it's um, yeah, Pelfrey. Me too. I was just talking about the my aquarium box from like a, like a year and a half ago. Same one, and and like you just use the little scooper, and I got a lot in it left. Nice. Um, but yeah, so I bought those two fish. I bought a little ball. Actually, it wasn't a little ball. It was like a softball sized piece of Chato. Oh, there five, you go. Five bucks. Cause yep, I, that's what I got, that's I got my, uh, I did a freshwater dip. I saw some big pods that I killed. Um, uh, but I, I just want to be careful because, cause that was in the tanks with the, like crabs and, and snails and stuff. So. Oh, you, oh, you dipped your Chato. I didn't even, I don't even, I didn't even think about that. I probably well, I just freshwater it. dipped it. Cause I remember. A while ago, I was on a stream. I think it was like CJ's, like two years ago, and they, they uh-huh. told me to do it. So I well, did it, and like it was cold, like real cold RO water. So yeah. it, it, like within like three minutes, I seen like a, a few like nice. big pods dead on the ground or yeah. on the bottom of the little container. But um, yeah, yeah bristle worms know. like to stay in there just to be safe, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, but yeah, um, no, I, I hear you. No, no screw ups now. You know, starting fresh. Yeah, keep, I bleached the fresh. rock this time, so like. I don't, I'd have to go back and watch my videos, but I don't have any like die off really like any, like last time I think I had like a, like that after a month, it was like brown rock that took a while to go right. away. Like I don't have any of that. So I, I've been checking, I ch- checked my ammonia this morning, nothing or ammonia nitrate, nitrates. Yeah, that's good. That's good. I, I'm still using the rock I had from like a year ago. Actually, some of the rock I'm using is from my last tank, too. And if I bleach it with the rest of it. I was wondering about that. I was wondering if you kept that old rock. Well, I have. I actually put one of the rocks because, like, some of them have, like, a bunch of, like, 
green pallies that I don't want in the tank. I got this yeah. mushroom rock with these red mushrooms. I yeah, your red ones. <laughs> I don't think, yeah, I don't think I'm going to put them in the tank. So, like, I found one rock in there when I was pulling everything out yesterday um, that didn't have anything on it. So, I put that in the sump. I don't know. Just give me a little more bacteria, I guess. Yeah, shit. You know, I was thinking about putting uh, the zinnias in my sump. They say those are really good. I hear that, too. Filter feeders. So. Yeah, I hear that. Um, I don't know. Maybe. Yeah, we'll so so I, it kind of felt bad that I popped and dropped, but. That's all right. They'll live. They'll be all right. Yeah, all right. I still haven't got your stickers, man. I've checked today. No? Uh-uh. I, uh, I sent that out. Then you sent it out Saturday? Uh, I thought you said Saturday, but maybe not. I think Thursday with everybody else's. Okay, huh? Why can't Probably I publish? Up. Sorry, chat. Give me a second. I'm just trying to mess with my chat, and I messed it up. Um... Yeah, so I, um, along with that stuff I bought, I bought just another five red legging hermits because I have blue legs in there. So I figured throw some red legs in there, see how that looks. Nice. So I got like, I got like maybe 10 crabs in there. I, I put a, like, uh, last week I put, I might have been, it might have been Friday, I put a, uh, cleaner, cleaner strip in there. Yeah, so I got some, saying. I got some movement in there now. It's pretty cool. I'm pretty pumped but about you that. You don't have your primes up yet, though. No, because I want to. I'm going to build a new canopy. Oh, that's right. Yeah. And I don't want to. I don't know. I don't have a way to hang them. Like, I could do like a like a no canopy, but then it's like got the black brace. It just won't look good. So, what about the goosenecks? I thought about that too, but I don't know. That's an added yeah, cost. Those, like, even those are pricey though. Shit, you'd have to get what three of them or four. Well, oh, I'm out, I'm buying another one. What's up, Ryan? Um, I just DIY my stuff, man. As much as I can. That's what I'm gonna do because I was looking at these little L brackets at Home Depot the other day. Yeah, it's all it's all crap you can just get, you know, like it's just well, common sense type of stuff. Yeah. Well that's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking about just using little L brackets right here to the top of canopy and then rid this right to the back right. of the prime. So it'll should work out. It just gotta actually build the canopy and I was gonna try doing that yesterday, but before I knew it, it was like five o'clock, and I really wanted to go to that fish store. You gotta try to do that uh, that new giveaway that I I tagged you in it. That I saw one. that all that stuff. It was like right Dude, before I was getting this. A ton of stuff he's giving out. I was like, Mike, Mike should do this. He'll win this one. <laughs> right. Step aside, everybody. Step aside. <laughs> That's a whole. Uh, I, I think it's an AI Prime and all kinds of stuff. I do need an AI Prime. Yeah, four of them. Shit, you wouldn't even need T fives. Well, well, the reason for the T5 is just because I, I was just going to put it in there so I can get my coral in there because I don't have lights up oh, yet. Oh, right, right. So I was thinking I just have that four bulb sitting there. Uh, I don't even know how good the bulbs are. They probably I probably ran it for like a year or something, but I have them. I might as well throw it over at least so I can get the coral out of the small tank. Right. So I take that tank down. And even if I get like 50 bucks for that tank, tank and stand. What kind of tank happy. is it? Uh, it's, um, it's, it's like an – it's – forget which tank it is it's it's the all-in-one with like the black top on it um all the uh but it's yeah, not it, there's a name brand and then there's like another side it's like the coral life or whatever yeah but exactly but it's not the coral life there's like another like oh gotcha yeah no, it's not a knockoff because it's still like a name brand but not like that um so uh we will see um i don't know the only thing about that is when i bought it the guy tore out the the divider for like the sump in the back Oh, okay. So it's, I still I have it. It just needs to be siliconed in. So I'm thinking oh, maybe okay. I should just silicone it in myself, or do I just sell it as is and see if I can get even? I mean, I I, I, I would give it away to be honest. Right. I just want it out of here because we don't have we don't have central AC in my house. So it's like when the when the when it gets hot out, we everybody's got uh, ACs drooped out their window. So um, I want to take that out so we can put a. Um, like a like a bigger standalone AC unit in here in the house. Yeah, that'd be cool. Uh, yeah, oh, yeah. is experiencing difficulties. Check You're your hot out there in the summer or what? Uh, not really. So I'm from Florida. So when when I when when it gets hot, it's not that hot, you know. Yeah. What's That's going cool. on here? Yeah, something happened to the thing, dude. It says like I was I'm like presenting. I know. Let me. <laughs> I lost connection. Hold on. I'm gonna switch. Uh... You there? 
Yeah, I'm here. I wonder if anybody else can hear it because it says uh, you lost connection. I got like four Xboxes going right now, so I just switched yeah. to a different one. It's, it tells me I'm presenting. I don't. Yeah, it's because I, I think I'm out of it. Um, all right, let me try this again. Sorry, guys. I'm gonna. Um, it's not even showing the chat anymore. So let me end this. And all right. Yeah. I, I'll start again. All right. I'll be back. All right. Cool. All right. Late. I think we're back. Jumped to a different Wi-Fi. So let me see if this is still going. I think it is. I need to figure out a better way to do this. Yeah, guys. Let me. I think we're still there. Cool. I don't have to start a new one. It's getting a little warm in my room. I have to open a window. All right, and go here if I can find it. Right, we almost go. At least we didn't lose it this time. All right, we back. Think. Let's try this again. No season Tallahassee. What up, dude? Method, what's up? Ed, what's going on, buddy? A couple new people in here since the hiccup. Yeah, I got uh there's so many damn people in this house, and there's like if I had to guess 15 things, 15 devices connected to like three different Wi-Fi's, and everybody's like on the fastest one. So we go down to a the next fast is where I think it's like only my apex and a couple other things. Uh, I don't even need to just open a window. We back. 
Humphrey, come show us your fish tank. Pelfrey is sponsored over there. I see you, bro. As soon as somebody comes in here, I'm going to have to jump back on my phone. Yeah, I know. Um, I, one thing that sucks about these new laptops is all I have is you, you USB C's, and I got this thing, which I no, that's not it. I got another little connection where it's got like a bunch of different other like a it's got like a uh, like a scan disk slot. It's got like regular USB ports. Um, I thought it had a Ethernet cable port, but it doesn't. Because I can just unplug my Xbox right here and wire myself in. I'm the only one in the house with a wired Xbox. Love it. Never a bad connection. K-Town Reefer, what's up, dude? Warm, upgrade joys. Yeah, I know. Yeah, open the window. I don't need an AC. It's it's like 45 degrees out, which is actually really nice as opposed to this 20 or something we've been having. Someone want to show me a reef tank or uh, I don't know, a QT tank, freshwater tank. I don't even care. It's like so loud out there. He's playing an NBA. We're uh, 2K, super loud. I guess I could, but I can't even do that. I could go set my phone up there, but for whatever reason, I can't even. I need to figure that out. Uh, settings. Default speakers, voice, studio, important digital diagnostics, default microphone, FaceTime HD camera. Yeah, I don't I don't know. I need someone that has, an, that has a clue because I don't. Mike can't see tanks. Yeah. I mean, I could go out there and look at it, but it's too loud. It's going to be super loud, too. If he goes to bed soon, which maybe he will, I'll go out there. Show you guys what's going on with the fish tank. I need to put up a video up, update because I don't think I've updated since it was up. I think it was like three weeks ago I did a video. So, I need to put something out there. I'm playing Overwatch and listening. Uh, Ed, I've been playing Apex for a couple months now. I like it. I was playing PUBG before that. Uh, played a little Call of Duty in between. I'm all about the first-person shooters or even third-person. I like those. Mute myself for a second. Can you guys hear the background noise? Um, I don't know which picture you're talking about. Could be talking about the picture on like the stream picture is of my 30 gallon from like three years ago if that's what you're talking about it's not a bad little tank i mean i didn't know anything which i still don't i mean i know a little bit but no professional reefer that's for sure am i still muted no i don't know why this does it Let's do this. My bad. 
I don't know why I got to do this. I need to speak to somebody, somebody that has an idea as to why I can't hear anything. Like if I go to like the little control. Oh, what's up, Shy? Hey, what's up? What do you got? Like a fish tank running behind you or something? Uh, let me present you. What is this? There you go. Minus whatever in the middle. There you go. I don't think I've ever seen this tank. It's in the video. <laughs> I feel like I started watching when you're putting the 20 together. This is cool, though. What's running this tank? What's running it? Oh, okay. And the Kelsey right there. I told you to get that geo. There you go right there. I know, man. That's Kamora what everybody's saying. Right See that Kamora pump? I got one. Carbon doser. I don't have a carbon doser, but I got the Kamora. <laughs> yeah, I'm using some caulk right there. I don't know if that's my oh, connection or yours. What's that? I don't know if that's my con connection or yours. What's wrong with the connection? I don't know. It's just choppy. It might be mine, then. I'm in the basement. I hear you. It's fine. Yeah, it's all messed up. I got to do some cleaning, some uh, trimming in here. I got this uh, green style polish going wild over here. Yeah, it is. Yeah, what, um, yeah. How big is that tank? It's an 80 ohm. It's cool. I had a 150, but that was upstairs. It broke, so I had to put everything down here. So what are you about to have an 80, a 75, and a 20 a running? I want an anatomy tank with some cloud, a lot of clownfish. So yeah. I'm set that up. That's cool, though. It's hard to keep up with them names. Yeah, dude, I don't, I don't know either. There's like a million Zoa names. Yeah. There's like a name for every stick. I, I'm, I'm, I'm over it. Yeah, I'm running off. Lights. Is that a hang on the back filter? Yeah. What, it's Cheeto or something? This is not drill. No. Hang on the back. I don't so like how, it. So how are you doing that, going from a hang on the back down, down? I got that... Um, right here this hole is bringing it down right here oh so what you drill to hang on the back no it's not drilled it just can you see that oh it's one of those okay i thought it was like yeah. a hang on the back filter it's like a hang yeah. on the back uh overflow yeah okay has it like broken siphon yet uh it did it once it was coming up and i'm like man i couldn't stop. It was overflowing. I couldn't stop it. I was like, damn, I had to turn everything off. <laughs> yeah, that sucks. Yeah. But, uh, How's that calcium reactor doing? Is it set and forget it like everybody says? Yeah, it's good. I like it. It's better than dosing. My core's like a um, encrusting faster. And I do like, um, I want to put some of the mags in there for the magnesium. I put some of them. I bought another chamber. I got to hook up to it. To, I'll try to do that tomorrow. I don't think I, I hate this right here. The uh, auto top off Neptunes. The sensor goes bad on that. So I've had the I've Neptune, had this, uh, auto top off. Yeah. I've had problems with the sensors. I have um, I have the smart ATO micro, and I've been running that thing for. Well, I scratched my first one, but this one uh, I got it with that little cube tank I got. So it's been ran for probably a year and a half, maybe two years, and things still working fine. The pump works flawlessly. The uh, the sensor is, is straight. Like, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm happy with it. Well, I have another sensor. I'm going to try to um, 
put another one on there. Is that a five foot? Yeah. It's just it's just not wide. That's all. Really How wide narrow. is it? It's just real narrow. So what's like tw- so it's like a fifty five meaning like yeah fifty five yeah it's like a fifty five long. So you don't have much like room 55. for aquascaping. What's that? What you, you kind of gotta like with those you kind of build up. You kind of gotta like build up right because you don't yeah. have a whole lot of room yeah. to aquascape. Yeah, yeah, like yeah, build it up. There's no room in the back. Too, That's too nice narrow. though, dude. Sucks having a, a tank in the basement though, doesn't it? Like you, everybody can't see well, unless you bring it down the basement. I want a I want a uh, one eighty upstairs. That's what the other tank had broke, but I'm trying to save up for it. I'm looking at that crystal. What's that called? Crystal Dynamics. That's in California, I think. Uh, I'm trying to save up for it and get it shipped here. Yeah, when I was at the fish store yesterday, they had a few tanks like rimless, like real thick. Um, Oh man, that 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 may be my next tank, a rimless. But I, the it worries me. Not it doesn't worry me, but like the um, evaporation, like mm-hmm. I, like I feel like I'm going through a lot of it right now. And like I have a canopy on mine, which doesn't do a whole lot, but I don't even know what I, I bet I'm running through probably like like I don't know. I bet I'm running through like a gallon and a half a day if I had to guess. Okay. I don't know if that's a lot. What do you think? What are you running on that one? How, how much? Any idea? I've never. <laughs> I just put water. Never thought in the about it. I just put water in the bucket every time I come down. Yeah, right. We don't don't calculate. Yeah, it. I got a seven. I got like a right now. I just got like a seven gallon like uh like this little like water tote yeah, Walmart uh, kind of thing right there. That's five gallons. Mm-hmm. So maybe man, five gallons a day. I guess. that too much i don't know i don't calculate it i just put some in there every day how much are you running through thinking i, I put i put in there about half the time that's what it's I... going by the time like the next day so about half of a five gallon yeah yeah that's like two gallon gallon a day. Day. that seems like a lot though, doesn't it yeah i want to um if i could i wish i could somehow plumb Obviously, it won't be in the house I'm at now, but, you know, eventually, if I ever, like, get my my ish together, then I'll set it up to where I can have, like, my my RODI running directly to it, which would be cool. That's my plan, anyway. Uh, auto auto water changes would be dope. Like, that would be mm-hmm. ridiculous. My, my water station. My RODI right there. Yeah, I need to do something like that, man. Mine's so makeshift right now. Are those? Are those? How big are those brutes? That's, uh, that's the forty-five gallon. Two of them. Yeah, I got two twenties downstairs, but I feel like twenty would be enough. But then I, I don't know. It, it just—it's a lot of work. I wish I had my own house and I could do what I want. Like if I feel like drilling a hole through the floor. Well, I have I have my sister down here. Once she leaves, I got the next room over on the other side of this tank. I want to build me a in wall. I want to do a frag area, do all my frags and stuff in there. That'd be cool. And then uh, from upstairs, I'm going to have the tank coming in out of the floor for the pipes and stuff running in there. It's going to be our filtration room, too. Yeah, that, that's and awesome. this one on that, too, going through the wall. That's whenever she leaves. <laughs> that's going to be a big project. Yeah. Yeah, one of these days, I want to... I don't, I mean, I'd love to have a huge tank. I don't necessarily need to have like a 600 gallon or anything, but like, like a 125 would be cool. I just want like a six foot tank. Even like a 150 or something would be cool. Looking okay. Do I need to turn the light off? That's better, right? Yeah, that's better. Yeah, it is. It looks good though, man. Those mushrooms in the got, bottom got, left are pretty cool. I got a lot of encrusting stuff. That stuff encrusted. Right there. I know that's a bird's nest. This is a digitata. Which mushroom are you talking about? The ones right here? And I keep going to the left. Them mushrooms are pretty cool. Yeah. They're they going wild, too. Yeah, they are. 
<laughs> um, I like them digis. Um, Calypso, Calypso has one for me. Uh, he's got a he's got a digi like that for me. That's a bubble gum, right? He's got a that's he's got a, a forest fire one. I think it's. Well, that I mean, I, I I don't know any better, but that looks like a bubble gum to me. But the gum. forest fire is more, I think, green and red. Um, but I was looking at some bubble gums yesterday, and like for like an inch long piece, like a, like maybe like two branch, it was only like thirty five bucks or something, thirty dollars. Oh, okay. But yeah, dude, that's uh, I can't wait. I'm pumped. I, I it's, it's, it's gonna be a while before I bother throwing sticks in there, but. I think I'm ready for it this time. That's, that's about it. <laughs> that's cool, though. I like it. What do you got for fishing that thing? I was too busy looking at the coral. Um, self, what's that? self tank? Yeah, Desjardini. Uh, what you call that? A Scopus tank? Got a little rest. I got a um, maroon clown right there. What do you got? Some Billy Vision going on right now? Uh, this is the aqua shell of glasses. Nice tank, bro. You went? What was that? You went to aqua shell? No, I didn't go. <laughs> I'm going this year. We just missed it. Yeah, that, that was in Texas. I was working so. Oh, what do you, what, was there another one in? It's one coming in. Uh, it should be one coming here. It's like Michigan or Washington. Chicago. Is, is, is no, is it? Come back in Chicago. It's out by you. I didn't know that. Oh yeah, because George lives up that way. Calypso, we was just talking about you, bro. Talking Madge. Just is that like... a bird's nest right in the middle there? Yeah. Man, that thing's nice. That thing's chunky. Nano. Yeah. Have you seen uh, Calypso's tank? Tank? Yeah, I, I've seen some videos of his. Yeah, he's got a, I think like a twenty-eight and a or twenty-seven like, or something, and he's got like a little seven and a half, and they're both pretty dope. Hell yeah, that's like super neon in there. Yeah, that's cool. I like that. That's the one thing I, that I've never had is dark rock. Like, you know, I've only had a couple fish tanks. Well, I got never... all these blue pods all on my rocks. Oh, uh, that's what it is. Like everybody's everybody's tank looks so clean when it's like dark rock, but like I right. always have like this white rock, maybe like a little brown or something. But it'll can, it'll get there. I know. Hopefully, I can have this because I don't see myself leaving this place for a while, unless I really get tired of living with roommates. It's, it's actually <laughs> crossed my mind. You know, it sucks when you're like a cl- not a clean freak, but like you clean and everybody else doesn't. Yeah, but then but then if you live by yourself, you ain't got no money for your fish tank. I'm telling you, bro. That's how my, I am, man. I'm my my, my more my rent or mortgage would uh on a low end go up like four or five hundred bucks a month. Yeah. I don't yeah. pay a lot now, but to live alone, like even like a dumpy spot. Yeah, dude, I live like, alone and I got I raised two kids and uh I pay seventeen hundred a month for a two bedroom. No, no. So that's what like up here, um, like if I want like a if I want like a one bedroom like dumpy spot like uh-huh. Main Street, it's like twelve hundred. Yeah. Thirteen hundred. So if I'm looking at like a two bedroom, it's like fifteen, seventeen. Yep. And I like I guess I could do it, but I wouldn't have my it, just would, it would be a lot kinder. I'd have yeah. to get rid of my truck probably. I couldn't I'd probably have to get rid of my phone. I'd have to downsize everything because I like have a nice phone. I mean I pay well, a lot, you, but you sell cars, right? Yeah. Just fucking just step up your sales game, man. <laughs> uh, it's easier said than done. I mean, I did all right last I month. Know. I'm in I self I, too. I was top. I was top guy in February. Last month, we don't know yet because I tied, so it goes, down, it goes down to gross. Whoever has the highest gross wins. Oh, okay. So our sales is hard, man. It's it's a brutal game. Well, I got a my store is good. I got a good pay plan. I got a good group of people. Like like our store isn't like the rest where it's like a new salesperson every month. Like we've had our newest guy has been there for two years. Damn. So yeah, it's it's pretty decent. We got a good setup. What's up, Tyler D? Um, we got a pretty good thing going right now. Um, That's cool, man. So if as long as I work, I can make money, right? I mean, if I can make like, if I can make between like eight and nine grand a month, like I'm 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 happy with. That. Obviously, I would love to make ten, twelve, fifteen, but if if I do like eight or nine a month, I'm pretty happy with that. Right. Yeah, I know. I always give people a hard time. That's got like wives and stuff. They're always yelling at them. But really, yeah. it's, it's the wives that keep 
them in check in the bills in order. Right, seriously. You know, right. Like, when I was with when I was with my ex, is like is like hard as it was, we argued and stuff. It's like she kind of kept me out of trouble. You know, she yeah. raised money, so it was the two of us putting in on this nice house we had. So now that yeah, I'm on my it's own, catch, it's, it's like twenty two. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Can't live with him. Can't live without him. Yep. Yep. Calypso, what's up, buddy? What are you doing, man? Oh, my bad. Shot Town's uh. Calypso, what's up, buddy? What are you doing, man? Who's got who's got their who's got their stream up? Well, not mine. Okay. Okay. I'm thinking about getting an eel, dude. I've thought about it. There's a bunch of stuff I've no thought about getting. There was this pretty cool little. I'm not that I would have even ever bought it yesterday, uh, but there was a little like yellow box fish, whatever those little yellow guys are. Oh, uh, I think the little tiny ones. Well, this one was like probably like the size of a half dollar, so bigger than than the ones that I've seen. But That's I don't know cowfish, right? I don't know. It's like a little box. I don't know it's box fish. I don't know cows. Uh, I don't know. It's cool I know though. Those cows, those cows, they I think they get super big, don't they? I don't know. I, I'm not into like that weird stuff. Like people yeah. like eels, like I think they're pretty cool, but I don't want to have to like hand feed them like a shrimp every day. That, people dude, are telling that's me, why I do want one. I think that would be badass, dude, just to have them. To actually, I have to feed it every day. Something. Hell yeah! Put some. I was thinking about putting some like one inch pipe through the back, under some sand, and letting them have like a little underground area. Yeah, like I remember because Travis had Reggie, his little his uh, his eel. Uh-huh. And it, it was just like to the point point where like he got tired of feeding it every day. It was, it was like having a like, dog. <laughs> well, he was yeah, yeah. It's like having a whole yeah. It's like having a whole new hobby. And, and, and I thought about that too because you do have to you do you have do. to. Hand feed that's them, like so. that's like those dendro corals, like uh, philodendrons. Like they're super awesome sun corals. They're super awesome, but right now you know I have to feed them every day. Like. Yep. And you got to, like, isolate them when you feed them, too. You have to, like, put some sort of, like, tube around them, right? Yeah, basically, because if you miss, then... And they only come out when they feed, I think. No, the the, the sweepers are out. The sweepers are out a lot, but... Well, from what I've seen, I'm not any expert by means, but the sweepers are out, and they're really cool looking. Those are awesome. It's too much work. I don't want to make... Calypso, what up, dude? I don't want to make the hobby harder for me. Yeah, no, Um, I hear you. Calypso said he's doing some surgery to his new tank. He dropped the drill. What'd you do? What'd you do, Calypso? Look, I messed up, man. That's some surgery. Did you just? Oh shit! Oh, you cracked oh, it. No. Damn. Is that the fourteen? Yeah, the new. I just I bought a new one to do the two tanks together. I fucked up, man. That's glass. <laughs> okay. So what are you? What are you gonna do? I'm gonna put. Uh, uh, like three bottles of silicone. Oh, good luck, man. That's a lot of pressure. Yeah, be careful. I mean, it's only in this corner right here. <laughs> That's it, you know. And yeah, the, the, the water, the just water, the ta- get yeah. to here. Just fill the tank halfway. Go. You're good. You're gold. So the only pressure is going to be right here in this little corner right here. I don't know, man. That's a gamble. <laughs> I mean, it's not That's like awesome. 180 where you got to worry about a ton of water going on the floor. You weren't standing on it when you were drilling it, were you? Nah, nah, <laughs> man. I, I just, my hand slipped and plop. Oh, it sucks. And, and it's yeah. thin. This glass is really thin. Hey, but you've drilled a bunch of tanks before, so you know yeah, what you're doing. Yeah, it's the first time I cracked one. <laughs> Did you make that one yourself, or is that like a pre-made? No, they, they come pre-made already. I got another one there. I wonder why that glass is so thin. Because it's only 14 gallons. They probably don't... They're trying to keep the cost down on a 14 yeah, gallons. You don't want to yeah. put thick glass in it. Yeah, I drew one side, but then when I get to that side. But that one's that one's going to be the refugium, right? Like a display refugium? No, no, because I'm trying to uh, replace that with seven and a half. So I can have everything running in one system. Did you silicone that backing too? What happened? Did you silicone that backing that you have on there? Yeah, yeah. It might hold because that looks like a pretty big. Yeah, uh, and I'm gonna silicone everything again, all around it again. So that might hold. I would just fill it up and let it sit for like two weeks. I yeah, mean, it's see, be, see what happens. Yeah, it's gonna be some pressure, but how much pressure is 14 gallons? You know, silicone, especially with displacement. Silicone and glass, though, man, that shit holds pretty damn tight. 
Yeah, yeah, especially small ones. But we'll see. Yeah, I don't know. That just sucks, though. <laughs> what you, what, what, what would you spend on those tanks? Probably not. They're probably not too cheap. Oh, uh, fifty fifty dollars. Well, that's not bad. Yeah, but that was the last one they had. <laughs> that's. I funny. bought an old pet club, and 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 the one close to me, I bought the one I got back here, and that one I bought in the other one, more farther. So. Damn man. Yeah, that's, that's a tricks for nothing. But it's alright. Was the blade feel... dull or something, or are you what just happened? messed up? What happened? Was the blade dull or anything, or did you just like? No, mess no, up? no. It was, it was me. It was me. Like I, I, um, the drill slipped out of my hands. When Damn. I was coming down to drill again, I cleaned it to see how far I was in, and when I was coming down, it just, boop, a li- yo, uh, it was just a little nip, boom, and it just, boom. yep. I know all about it. Yeah, <laughs> like I don't know, I don't know if you're familiar, but I had a uh, fish a hex come to my yeah, house. Yeah, I saw the video. Yeah, I that shit that. shattered. I didn't know what to do, man. Like I was like, that's what like, I oh, thought. Cracked, when, and he looked when, at me. When like, this one went crack, I thought about you. I said, oh, there you go. Yeah, like I'm like, I didn't know any better. I was new, or newer than I am now, and I was like, well, so what do we do? Do we just like silicone it, or he's like, nah, bro. He kind of giggled at me. He's like, nah, dude, we got to get in the tank. Yeah, so I had to like run, and we didn't have a whole lot of time because he he was like limited on time because he still had to drive four hours back to or five hours back to Harrisburg. Bro, so I'm um, prepared. I'm a, I'm gonna make sure there's no leak in that back <laughs> wall, bro. Dude, I flex sealed. I flex sealed my the whole bottom of my. I just stand gotta just make sure no inside the tank. That's all. My brother works for a glass company. I wonder if he can make me a tank. Yeah, I, I bet he can. He probably got some good connections on glass. I mean, you can watch, like, I'm pretty sure um, King of DIY, is, he's made his own tanks. It doesn't seem that hard. You just got to be nah. You just got to be So to get it, particular. like, beveled and all that, to, like, sanded and beveled. Yeah. yeah. They, they you just got to make sure you cut it, you know, to to the exact pieces that you need, you know? So yeah. So when you put all together, it just make a square, rectangle, whatever yeah. you yeah. aim it for. But I think I can have this made. I got a glass company around here, and it's easy because the the um the silicone work they do on those things they, it's cheap. I have to always reseal them. So plus it's, it's the back, so it doesn't yeah. need to be clear, you know. Yeah, exactly. So yeah, yeah I can have them drilled for me too, so that way I don't <laughs> mess up. You know what you you know what you could do? You could put like you could fit a black piece of silicone the same size. And then yeah. just silicone or a back black piece of acrylic and just acrylic. like silicone the crap out of it. Yeah. And just then the run hole, like the size and, of the yeah, back. Yeah, and kind of line it up with another hole and just run the run that run the uh bulkhead through it. I mean through it, yeah. Yeah. I, but, I but what, that's what I was thinking too. Yeah. It's, it's not a it's not a bad idea. But what sucks is that you, uh you gotta get the right silicone because yeah, it won't, I got, bond, it won't bond to glass and uh, oh, glass and acrylic. Yeah, right. yeah. and the acrylic the same. I, I got that's the aqua. Weaker, uh, it's weaker on the acrylic. Yeah, 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 yeah you're but, right. Yeah, but how much pressure can really be in a 14 gallon? I don't know. We're about to find out. <laughs> <laughs> let's let's start a BRS uh, investigation. Yeah, right? BRS right? <laughs> investigations. Let's start cracking all the tanks and see how you know. How much water can you put in here? <laughs> <laughs> I want to see what you can do with like a forty breeder. Yeah, because I mean he's got two little smaller tanks and they they're both dope. You didn't go go check wow, go check my page. That's what I started the page with a forty breeder. Did you? Yeah, Some guys take the tops off of those and make it a. Yeah, that's what I did to mine. Yeah, you just gotta you gotta put the. You know the support. That's where the guy left that message. Learn how to speak English, you Puerto Rican. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, in that same video. Yeah, I I I I was loving that thing. Matter of fact, I just didn't like because I put um an H two O overflow, and that thing wasn't quiet, man. That's uh, I'm gonna have to go back and watch because I didn't know you when you had a forty. Yeah, that's what I started the the page with a forty breeder, and then we jumped to the little one. I don't know why. Yeah. I, I still love always have so. Yo, shout down. You see his uh, his mixing station right there? Yeah, I see it. Two thirteen gallons, and it works mint. Yeah, that's tight. 
Yeah. I like how he's got the RODI above it too. Yeah, that's all he needs. Yeah. I mean, what are you what are you doing? Like a five gallon, ten dollar, ten gallon water change on that one upstairs, and you could probably do like a two gallon water change on that seven gallon. Yeah, yeah. No, on the seven on the seven gallon, I do eight cups. Eight cup eight water cups change. Cups. That's yeah. sweet. Dude. <laughs> Imagine that. That's why I, I mean, want to go back to Canada, I did like, man. Like, like two gallons, I will say. Because I cleaned the shit out of yeah, the Yeah, you just like, you grab like a, like a four cup. Yeah. Yeah. And just... yeah, like I'm mixing salt the same yeah, way. Yeah, dude. That's cool. Has, uh, have you tried drinking RODI water? Is that safe to drink? Uh, I heard it is. It's fine. But I, I researched it. Um, it there, it's like, it's like it's lacking some of the minerals that you need so it's right. fine yeah yeah it's yeah. fine take, like, but it's not ideal out, right and then use the other ones like the charcoal and something else k-town i didn't take over anything i took over random live streams there's no <laughs> there's no rhyme or reason to my live streams it's just like i'm on my way home like, coming back with a vengeance <laughs> should i just live stream tonight i guess so whatever run it hell yeah it's... i reach out to a couple people see if anybody can stream and Today everybody said no, and I'm like, screw it. Somebody will join anyway. Yeah. I think oh, Murphy man. Murphy's been doing uh, Saturdays recently. Yeah, um, I talked to him the other day uh, on on um, on I think it was uh, Instagram, and we were talking about streaming. And I was like, I was going to stream on Saturday. I was like, yo, actually, I te- I texted him. I was like, hey, you you want to stream today? He's like, well, I was thinking about streaming, so you know, I definitely I'm not going to step on anybody's toes. Yeah, that's. I'll step on toes when it's like somebody that, like like uh, Neptune's was streaming like last week and like oh yeah, like I don't I mean they're, yeah great but I'm, I mean I'm not like I'm I'm not stepping on their their toes. It's kind of a little community though with all of us you know it's yeah we're, there's a bunch of regulars so yeah I mean, uh, acro breeder what's up buddy years, you know. So, one of these days, I'll stream from my fish tank, maybe. Yeah, we need yeah, to see. We need That's to what we all wait for. Tank, man. <laughs> There's not a whole lot to see, though, especially with a... With a you, gotta, you gotta show it off, man, no matter especially what. Especially with a tank with no light on top. That's, the whole, that's the whole point of progression videos, bro. So, why you haven't put the, the AI Prime to that? Because I want to build a canopy. Oh. That's I don't right. want to buy, like, brackets, and that's just added expense. I'd rather just build something. Yeah, look, look nice. Yeah, I got you. And the, the canopy I have is only like six inches deep, and I think the AI primes need to be higher than that. Yeah. Click clack if you can uh, prove me wrong. Or Yeah, or, I don't uh, know how powerful the AI primes are. I don't know how close you're going to need to be. Well, I have three of them, so I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to buy another one. So I, I think four AI primes in a four-foot tank is probably pretty decent. Yeah. You know? And I was gonna do three. I was just gonna do, you know, three. You probably spread be fine, out. Be honestly, I was just gonna spread out three of them. But I got um, I got a, a center brace, so it's you know, it's it'd be just be the middle one, just be blocked out. Why don't you just sell the three primes you have and get two fifty twos? I buy one. Four hundred for one. Got you. <laughs> I'll buy two. Is this a 50, <laughs> right, deal. Right, that's the one. Four lights. Uh, what? The the Hydra fifty twos, right? That's the four. Yeah, but uh, them things are them things are. How much are they? Yeah, but all you would need is two, though. Yeah, but they're probably more than what I spent on. They're like six hundred, I think. They're like yeah, 600. exactly. He's like, oh, just buy a just buy a hybrid. It's only six hundred. Okay. Yeah. yeah I know. This shit's expensive. Yeah, so yeah, what is? What does silicone silicone do? Siliconing silicone. Is that like added protection or is it going to bond that well? I have no idea. I don't know either. Yeah, you know, definitely starting the 75 has has opened up my uh, checkbook a little bit from all my nanos. Is Is this the biggest tank you've ever had? Yeah. I had my old channel, remember? I don't know if you remember or not, but I ran a 20 long. For like a year, I do. I remember that you yeah. had it. Um, I had the black. You didn't have it. it in. You didn't have it in the corner. You had it on like that little wall between the doors. Yeah. I think, right? 
I think so, yeah. And then then you got the nano that went in the corner. Yeah, yeah. I started with yeah. the with the uh the nano in the corner. I built that stand yeah. for that too. Then I upgraded to the twenty long. Yeah, I remember. I had the black sand. That thing was actually looking pretty nice. It I was. I kind of like the black sand. I didn't want to do it. I, I thought about it this time, but I don't know. I, I like. I, um, I kind of regret it. I wish I would have went back with it. I still even might put it back in. I don't know. The, the one thing I I, uh, I I and this is just personal opinion. I don't know anything more or less. Uh, but I think like, you know how like. Um, Basically, when, like when people sunbathe, they're they're looking up at the sun. They got like that that uh, whatever it is, like this chrome reflective stuff, so the so it can come back up at them. That's how I feel uh, about white sand. It kind of like right. reflects some of the light back up as well, opposed yeah, to just black. I, and that could just be total BS. But like when you're growing plants too, like I, you know, right. there's been times where I'll I'll, I'll just make like this tin foil like reflecting like bowl and, and like put it under that you know put kind right. of flitting it and just slide it over the stem so the light can hit the top but then reflect back down and go up I, right whether that does anything i don't know but i just i don't know yeah. i kind of feel like it does again i, I could think... be totally full of full of nothing you know and just making stuff up but <laughs> it's, uh that's how we learn man yeah i don't know i'm just uh just trying why when i was growing plants i heard even a black panel is actually good reflective for i don't know how but good for what was a good reflective light um, reflective i don't well, know i don't really know I how like i didn't to, look into it much but. what i did like to do and i didn't do this every time because I, I forgot a lot of the time was i like to <laughs> I like to do that like little reflective thing I'm talking about when they were like young, like before they got like a foot tall. Oh, right, right. Just, I don't know, just a little added light because most of the time I didn't have a good light, you know? So it was yeah. like I'm using like little CFLs or something. And you don't so. need good light on your veg state, you know? You don't. No, I grew I that. Up, Dude, I grew eight. Well, I know I probably shouldn't be talking about it, but. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> I, I, I ended up running a 1200 watt. <laughs> I ended up running a 1200 watt LED over it. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. I, remember. Yeah. I ran it for like I ran it for actually between the tent. This is pretty cool. Between the tent and the LED, um, and running the tent for about a year and the LED for about only like five months, I only lost twenty bucks after oh, I, I sold that it. Yeah. So that, that that wasn't bad at all. I remember you ran into a bunch of problems. At yeah, first, remember it was like, like my the... first. It was like my first fish tank, you know, and just running into yeah. problems because you don't know. Any, I still don't know any better. Yeah. Like, this year, None of us do. That's this what's year, about. Like all these professionals that have been doing this for years and years, it's always something new to discuss. You to know deal I mean? with, yeah. Yeah. It's 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 not because there is no perfect curve to this. There's there's just not. So, the one thing I like about here, let me um give me one second. Let me mute myself for one second. I mean, look at the oceans, man. They're dying right now. Nobody really knows why, you know, just from the heat and I know why. Huh. We're killing them. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, that's, yeah, you're right there. Probably half of it's because of us. Sad. Yeah, yeah it is sad, man. Because that's, I'd love to go scuba in the Great Barrier one of these days before I die. But I know. I know. Yeah, but is, is it even, is it even really, I mean, obviously it's going to be fun regardless. But huh? Is it even, is it even that good I anymore? I think there's some spots, but a lot of it's really dying off. A lot of it's bleaching. I watched. I watched this thing. I watched this thing that I think I saw on like Facebook. It might have been like one of those like uh, sponsored videos, um, and they're basically saying like um, like micro fragging is like the way of the future. Like instead of like cutting off a frag and trying to replant it, they're getting much better growth right. by micro fragging. I think I heard that too. They're actually um, putting them it, back. It's, in it's like tiny little frags. Yeah. And they're like, instead of like, instead of like taking like a colony and making 30 frags or taking a colony and making like right, 150 right. frags of like tiny, tiny little nubs. And they're, they said it's growing quicker. Hmm. So I don't know if you could apply that to the, the, the reef tank right. at all. They're saying like, they're saying they're, they're the reef to the, um, some of the, well, let me back up. They're, they're doing a lot of this in the keys and the, the Florida keys is like really coming huh. back, I guess. That's interesting. I'm a firm I'm a firm believer in uh, like global warming. I think like all the like the 
well, like refineries and well, like factories and stuff yeah. throwing crap into our air. Yeah. You know, it's. I mean, if 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 the temperature in our in our reefs is changing over time, like something's wrong. It's not just going to change, you know, like for right. no reason. So, I think I think I think uh, humans will, will be the death of Earth. Oh yeah, eventually. it's just a matter of time. Really. <laughs> yeah, like because the water is getting hotter, like days are getting hotter. Dude, our summers it's are lasting like, like long. You know, could our be winter sucks. We used to have like. You know, five dude. foot blizzards, dude. We don't get those anymore. Yeah, you're right. You know, I we, we haven't had like a we haven't had a we haven't had a bad winter in probably like wow. three months now, or I mean three years now. Actually, uh, random. We're getting we're getting up to four inches tomorrow, which is yeah kind of crazy. We get two inches, and it's like, oh my god, it's a blizzard. Everybody stay home. It's like dude, it's two inches outside. Yeah, right. I know. Yeah, our blizzard now. I'm what? from Florida, so it's like any snow sucks. Where are you at, Calypso? Yeah, you. He's in Connecticut. Oh, you're in Connecticut. You're, you're a little getting, closer to me. You're getting snow oh, no, tomorrow, then, right? That way. Never mind. You're getting snow tomorrow, clips, though, right? Connecticut gets snow, right? Oh. Yeah, well, he's right next to me. I don't either. I, I I get up there. I get weather channel. What the hell is phone. There's a winter winter weather advisory in April. It's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. That, that is crazy. We also get the most tornadoes every year too, but they're like way out east. Tornadoes. Yeah, uh, Colorado's got like. The I don't think I've ever. I don't, uh, yeah, I don't think I've ever seen a tornado. I've seen like uh, downspouts, like water spouts. Oh yeah, yeah, those are cool. I'm uh, I'm more seasoned in hurricanes being yeah. from Florida. Yeah. Yeah, it's like crazy. Like I moved up here and it would like rain a little bit, and people are like, "Oh, it's pouring," but it's really nice. It's just, like a light rain, and people think it's pouring. And you got to deal with like, all that humans. Like these, like marble sized. Droplets of water right. everywhere, and it's just like really pouring. You know what I've been looking at a lot lately, um, and I, I'm going to apply this eventually. But like, um, I kind of like have kind of been changing changing my idea of like, you know, growing up in the reefing hobby. Just over the past few years, it was always like, in my opinion, it was like, oh, low nutrients equals like a healthy tank. But like, I've, I've kind of like rethinking my whole thinking yeah, yeah. have you seen what like, brs is doing uh probably what do you they're refer to that uh they're gonna do a test on a on two identical tanks with identical corals and they're gonna like dose one tank to the max like the max dosages phosphates and nitrates yeah, and all that yeah and they're gonna see if you get faster coral growth that way or if it's gonna cause like a you know uh a, a a breakdown or whatever, a collapse. You know what's pretty awesome is they're doing this whole uh, calcium reactor deal, uh, and it's like right in the time that I'm starting up with the calcium I reactor. Know, so right? I'm, I'm pretty pumped about that. Yeah. Every time I see a calcium reactor, I'm like, I always think of my climbing. Yeah, all right. <laughs> all right. Let me catch up to these chats. It's not like there's many. Uh, Aquamate, what's up, dude? Aquamate. Uh, I don't know if I'm subscribed to you. I subscribe to like everybody, dude. It, when I jump on my when I jump on my like uh, my subscriptions, like there's so many videos every day. I know. I, I know. watch most of them. I don't have crap for subscribers, dude. I got I probably got crappy videos though. I need to learn. I, I, need I, to I got videos. crappy videos too, dude. Mine aren't anything special. Like you also do like mine is crappy. <laughs> Man, hey, crappy. the important thing we share in information. <laughs> it don't matter if it's good or bad. Yeah, that's true. I like just doing it. I like being part of the community. That's all I care about. Chimp the Reefer. Sorry, Chimp. I'm just catching up. What's up, buddy? What's up, bum? I don't know what to do. Let me see your remote. See, uh, just read it. I don't. I don't know. It says you have to hold the square button. No, all of it. All of it, Dad. Yeah, he's playing some. <laughs> Somebody with a reef tank, come show us. Target two tight boat handles at the same time. You got to grab both of the ropes at the same time. Wait, can you help me do it? No, I don't know how to play these games. What's he playing? Uh, Lego Spider Man. Oh. He can't right. figure out this part. I'm yeah, horrible yeah. at those games. Let me, um,.
Can you tell it was crack? No. Not now. Hell. <laughs> what what crack? <laughs> what? Well, why you say? <laughs> it's because you used it's because you used about three pounds of silicone on that thing. Oh yeah. And that's the first hand. I gotta do a second hand. You know what scares me, dude, is I saw a video of this guy 75 and he had a, a home video camera in his uh, house while he was at work. And yeah, the, tank, yeah. the tank just cracked out of nowhere. Yeah, That's crazy. And I was like, oh my God, that's like my worst fear. Right. That's and like, the um, one, the 90, what is it, 915 man um, put up, um, he put in his channel? What? Like, um, the guy nine wife, nine, nine, one, five, five, man. Oh, nine yeah. One five man. yeah, yeah. I think he, he posted on the game channel. It's his friend, that is like not nah, his friend. Oh, no, no kidding, huh? Yeah, I you think, well, I... I think it's, it's the same video. Yeah, he had a uh, the camera facing the tank, and right, it just and all of a sudden you know what... it just goes crack, and then just not all at once, but it just came out the crack. The water, started yeah, 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 it started dripping. Yeah. Paul Blaney did it one time. But it's crazy people trying to drill a tank with water in it. Like, that's... Oh, they're drilling with water in it? Bad idea, yeah. Yeah, yeah I've seen that. I, I wouldn't do that. that. Like, uh, I've seen a couple of them. If you just, like, YouTube, like, tank explosion, basically, most, <laughs> yeah. of, them, most of them are people with water in it. Like, why would you even... Right. Why do you even do that, right? Yeah, like, just <laughs> put everything into a brute trash cans and do it. Yeah. Like those those big ones in those restaurants that, that... I mean, lazy people anything work. throw it in the bathtub. I mean that's better than drilling a tank full. Mm-hmm. I did it in my living room on a tarp. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta take that outside and do that. That's right. Bucks. Yeah, I wish I could have done it outside. I just don't have the room. I just moved into an apartment from a house, which sucks. Yeah, we'll see what's going to happen to this one. I'm going to fill it up with water and just... Are you filling it up tonight? No, 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 no. I got to wait until the... Um, 24 hours. Uh, yeah. But just put it in the bathroom full of water and just see what happens. And, and I'm going to put the actual shower just dropping water in there. So I think it's full completely, you know? Yeah. Keep us posted. That'll be interesting. Yeah. I'd like well, to see if that holds. Hey, Mike. Yes, sir. That uh, seventy-five you drilled with uh, fish, fish X. What uh, what's the name of that tank? Uh, I think that was a marine one. I okay. think I, I bought an Alquion, and I tried to call them to see if it was tempered. They don't know. Yeah, they don't know. I, I did the same thing because the dollar per gallon, uh, the seventy-five is only ninety bucks. Yeah, that's what I got mine for. Yeah, so I bought one, and I was scared. Like I tried polarized glasses, I couldn't figure it out. I, I know, did that too. <laughs> Really? I couldn't figure it out, so I reached out. To, I reached out to them. And they're like, uh, it was basically like it was weird. I reached out to Petco, and they're like, "Oh, contact uh, Aquion." I reached out to Aquion. They're like, "There's no way for us to tell." Um, so reached out to Petco, and they referred me to Petco. Like, great! Like you guys are telling me to go back and forth, and I got nowhere. So I ended up just returning it. There's usually a label that will tell yeah, you. Yeah, it's a bot. It says it says tempered. Don't drill, but. A lot yeah, of mine's times. on the bottom, which I don't know why the hell you'd have tempered glass on the bottom. Mostly, yeah. Because I, I don't know. The bottom. I mean, probably I put a piece of plate. egg crate so the rocks won't hit it. Yeah. But these, these little tanks are aquan and they drillable. But at 29 I have, I drilled that one. That was drillable. Yeah. I took a chance. I didn't know. I just took a chance in the bathtub. Yeah, yeah. and see what happened, right? Yeah. That's why. What do you want to drill the bottom or the back? I'm pretty sure it's I, I drilled the, the back. On the new one, though, the 75, what do you want to drill? The back I'm or the bottom? The back, yeah. Oh, you do want to do the back? Yeah. Yeah, that's going to be, unless you can't get any uh, answers, I guess it's just a risk. Yeah, we'll take a chance <laughs> on it. If it cracks, <laughs> it busts, it busts. Right? Yeah. <laughs> you know what? When my when my um, 27 gallon, it, it's, it got that sticker, that orange sticker, do not drill. But I'm going to yep. try. I'm going to try. I don't care. If it, if it explodes, it explodes. I just got to get everything out of it before that. It's tough, dude. Good luck. I guess that's why we <laughs> pay the big bucks for the uh, pre-drilled all-in-ones, huh? <laughs> yeah. Hey, we'll see what happens. 
Yeah. That was always my motto. We'll see what happens. That's for sure. We'll see what happens. Yeah. I mean, 90 bucks, it's it's not too big of a loss, I guess. I mean, yeah. 90 bucks, though. Mm-hmm. That, that could be 94 already pretty good one. That's a big-ass torch right there. Torch frag. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's a nice piece of coal. Yeah. I know that's what I'll be thinking sometimes. I'll be spending money. Say, man, I can get a core with this. What's what's the UV like uh, test or the UV glasses test on the glass? Doesn't it like show up with little waves or something? I couldn't uh, see. It's not UV. It's um, te- it's um, polarized. So you basically or the polarized, you, yeah. You take uh, I don't have a pair of sunglasses to show you, but like, I don't know. Say like say like this. This is your sunglasses. You put them on right here. Uh huh. to take it and like turn it, and like if it goes dark, then you're good. Like when you turn it, if it goes dark, you're good. If it doesn't, it's not. But like I tried it on the tank and it didn't go dark. But then I went out to my truck and I did it. I and I knew it said it said polarized right on it and it didn't show mm-hmm. like no darking out anything. So I don't know. That's kind of sketch too. Yeah. Yeah. I wasn't really sure. Hmm. Well, good luck, man. Shit. Yeah, we'll see. Yeah, we'll see. That's for we'll sure. We'll see. <laughs> but ain't some some tanks that I drilled already are tempered. You'll find out pretty fast. <laughs> yeah. I, I ah. think some they say they temper and they drill. Probably not the glass they really drill. Yo, Calypso, are you getting any deals lately? You get, get me any frags lately? The magic. Yo, we was talking about you earlier, bro. Yeah. That, uh, that did you got? You got a um, forest fire, right? Yeah. I don't know, but the green doesn't want to come back to it. The green? I got green on mine. Right on the tip. Yeah, yeah. Say again. 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 Say Get ready for the grind tomorrow. All right, dude. Thanks for joining. Yeah. See you guys later, man. Later. Later. Look at that. You're just doing the whole thing tonight, huh? Yeah. Well, just, yeah, trying to finish it so I can uh, tomorrow put water, see what happens. Because I was ready. If it wouldn't crack, I would have connected that thing tonight. Yeah, but I went and I went to buy all the PVC, all the all the stuff that I needed to connect both together. But I just, ugh, you know, that feeling. But I think it'd be okay, man, because um, I didn't do no no like once it cracked, I didn't. I just finished drilling it, and that little piece um, it's it's a piece of acrylic. I glue it right away. Look, look what I all the glue that I put inside. I didn't have that much glue at that moment, but you can see in the inside all the glue. Is that the, that's that little piece of acrylic you put in there? Yeah. Just so, the on. It's kind of big, you know, like he's holding this this whole corner right here, the whole thing, and then in the oh, inside. Man. I mean, now you're not gonna see that much, but good luck, dude. Yeah. I'm still putting more glue in the bottom of there. Watch, it's gonna hold. Do your feet, the your water feet. is just gonna go up to here and then just drop to there. You know, it's not gonna force the whole top. But basically, okay. it's holding this right here, this, 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 and then it just go down. So I like you always just throw some duct tape on it. Yeah, yeah, I got some too, black one too. Got a match. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna bank the guy. I I ain't buying another tank. I would love to. I mean, at least it wasn't like a thousand dollars tank. Exactly. exactly. But I think I think it hold. It's it just a small tank, you know. It's not. It's not like it's a long tank. The, it, it got water pressure from the other side to that side. You know what I'm saying? I know my English. Nobody good looking. But I think you know what I'm saying. 
<laughs> we got you, buddy. Yeah. What's up, Neil? I think I think the pressure is gonna spread even in the in that queue. So. Yeah, yeah, you got a mess over there, huh? Oh yeah, just to to drill a tank and 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 paint and you know. Yeah, I'm gonna come. I'm gonna come get me a, come get me a, a frag and uh, frags and fades in a little oh, bit. Oh, they waiting on you. Frags and fades, bro. Yeah. yeah. Telling you, that's the new business. Frags and fades. You come frag and fades. You come, your tank and get if a you come pick up a frag, you gotta get a fade. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Let me show you, yo. That DG is growing like crazy. I don't know what Let I'm doing. Let me see my girl. I don't know if it's my height, um, alkalinity. Bro, I tested the other day. That thing was over 14. That's I don't know. Right there, Mike. See that, Mike? Mike. Yeah. Mr. Here. Billy. Mr. Billy. What? 75. Oh, no. 75. Right there. I'm going to put this right here. To the... Hold on. Hold on. You ever used one of these before? Uh, no, but I hear good things though. Look yeah, at that DG, bro. Let me see that. Hold on, hold on, shut down. My bad. One second. Okay, okay, see. okay. Yeah, that DG is pretty tight, dude. Yeah, when I got it, it wasn't like that. Yo, show the people your tank. Show the whole thing. What is it? Twenty eight? Is that what it is? Twenty seven. Twenty seven. That's a tight little tank, dude. Nice work. Thank you, man. It's Look been through a rough time. Yeah. Yeah, a little bit of everything, you know, easy stuff. Stuff that look good. I like it. But I can't wait, man, to get a bigger one so I can just, you know, like, do some work, so do some aquascaping, placing coral in the, in the right place. Because now I got the ideas, you know, so... What's a, what's a bigger tank to you? Uh, for me, for my liking, like a 66 gallon, a little long. Like a rectangle. Like, like three foot? Yeah, yeah. Like like the 40 breeder, kind of, but a little bit bigger. Yeah. yeah. That's dope, though. Where, you still got my little uh, digi frag? Of course. They're right there. Look, it's, it's already. Yo, what's up, girl? It got two hands. Look. There you go. What's up, girl? Look look at it, yo, it's like come hug me. <laughs> <laughs> but then you could either choose either oh I don't know why it's looking like that. Oh blurry. But that long one right there or this one. This one is the same as that one. But this one is more like a just a red digi. Cause even the the, the skeleton it looked red compared to the other one that's kinda of like what like bluish with the green. Yeah. Yeah. So that one and yeah, what a what a what a what a what a what a and your purples they're right there growing. Yeah, man, you uh you do some you do some shopping. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm in love with this Duncan man. It's different from this one. Look at this one and look <laughs> at that one. All those small little heads. So that first that that one closer to us. Um, that's what I used to have, and I've seen those other ones up there. The other ones have like puffier polyps, right? Yeah, yeah, puffier, sm a smaller. You can't really see the green like heads. Exactly, like... exactly. Yeah, and this one, yeah, and this one I got it since it was one head. No, I gotta give me some Duncans. I don't have any. I don't have. I don't have any. I used to. Um, <clears throat> it's they're hard. Right? When you get a one-headed Duncan, they start growing all those little babies at the base, and before you know, it, you got six of them. Yeah. That's 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 what this was. I bought this from Petco. Yeah, but it's it's doing good. You remember that red um oh, Monty I had that it was right there in the in the middle big one. Yeah, the, yeah, yeah. So that one, the only thing I saved from it was this. That oh, you got the red and green together. Yeah, I'm trying. <laughs> they don't want it. You, you glued them together. Yeah, but they don't wanna. They don't wanna cheer. It looks like they are though. No, they just like growing that circle motion. You see. Give it time. Yeah, soon. 
They don't want to cheer DNA right now. But, yeah, that was... All these Zoas. That rock, how's that rock's doing good, huh? That big one? That one? Yeah. Look at this tension on those. The eight cans right there? Yep. But it's, yep. it got different. It got some, like, look at this side. Greens and, and purple. Oh, yeah. And then over here, it's just more purple than green. Yeah, there's... Yeah, some are purple completely, only purple. Then the other one's got green. I want to frag it. I want to get those, those greens out. Put them look out. nicer. And whoever wants all the purple, they got all the purples. You're going to get rid of the purple ones? Yeah, like I'm trying to like keep more, mostly. I mean, I only could keep one head, you know. Whoever wants the other ones, you know, we could share. I don't care. You know me. Yeah. They, they keep growing. They keep multiplying. Whatever I'm doing is working, so I don't know. Yeah, this. How often are you doing water changes in that thing? In this one? Yeah. To tell you the truth, I haven't done a water change like in a month and a half. Really? Yeah. And it's all yeah. hang on the back. Yeah, just uh, this one is it's just the overflow with the shadow in the back. I mean, the bottom. That's it. Shadow and yeah, I no add, skimmer, like, no dosing, nothing. Yeah, I I do those. Um, you know, like I turn nutrition, the trace colors. Hold on, let me remove this. Piece. The trace color. This is magnesium because they seem to love magnesium. And um, Kowasser, that's it. That's it. Kowasser to try to like keep it stable uh, as much as I can. But other than that, that's all it's down here. It's cool to see. Yeah. Everybody goes high tech because they think they need to, which yeah. I'm one of those people. Yeah, I want to do it too because I want to. I want to go through the experience of having all that equipment, you know, and, and understand how it works. Yeah. That's that's why I wanted that sump down there for you know so have something nice. So you're like gonna that. get a skimmer this time and yep yep for that settle down there yeah because I got the skimmer but the pump doesn't want to work yeah all right shy time what you got bro let's see it I'm just, I'm just showing you that seventy five yeah let's see let's see let's see so, so you're gonna drill it and put that e shops on there huh yeah I hope I hear good things about the e shops I like how they come with like. The all like the drilling essentials minus the drill, I guess, but like uh, it comes with like a, a stencil or whatever you want to call it. It comes with all that stuff. I like that. Yeah, actually, I was looking at one of those the other day. In this way, but I forgot my nano can be oh no, this clay can be drilled. So, but you're kind of dead in the water because you don't know if it's tempered or not. Yeah, no, I don't know. Yeah, I feel you, dude. I went through the same thing, like. You know, I mean, unless you can really figure it out with the glasses and stuff. I tried that. I even tried that with the 29. I couldn't tell the difference. So. A lot of, a lot I, of people, I think it could be drill. It's an aqua one. I think it could be drill. A lot of people tell me just to... Uh, Where you got it from? Drill it and find yeah, out. From Petco. Yeah, yeah. You could drill it. Okay. Then I was looking at stands. I was looking at that um, that stand like uh, Rico has. What's the name of that? Uh, what was that? Framing Tech. The metal they one? They won five hundred dollars for it. I'm like, oh, no, I'm wow. gonna build my own stand. <laughs> hmm. so That's go crazy, some, right? Yeah, I'm gonna give me some two by fours and, and I'm gonna That's it. And yeah. color the day. Yep. Oh, why you don't get the metal one? They um the Petco cell. That one that uh, one's nice. I don't, the I don't like that. Just get covers. No, I don't like that. I'm, I'm gonna build it and I'm gonna wrap it and I'm gonna, I'm gonna paint it. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Yeah, uh Shy Town's hands on. Yeah. But just like when you drill it, just go slow. You know, you don't have to rush it. Just be patient and hold that drill tight. Yeah, the glass is thin too. So yeah. <laughs> I hope I'll do what you did. Oh man, yeah. Yeah, the glass is thin. And this is where I had my uh, my other tank at when it one that broke that one fifty. What what happened when it broke? The brace. So the braces cracked. It was then I came in home. I saw it. It was bowing. The top the break. They get the. They say get the water out. It's gonna break. This right here. Yeah. So that they snapped, cracked. So it was they bowing. Had, huh? They had three of them on. They cracked. They, it, right at the ends, right here. Damn. And you can well, look down on the side like, of it. You can see it bowing. 
Well, at least it didn't like blow out. And yeah. Flood you know, I broke my brake while the water's inside. Hmm? On my 75, when I had a 75. What about that it? brace was getting me mad, so I broke it. And that thing went like, and, and it made a sound. I said, oh, I'm, I'm you know. <laughs> but it didn't, it didn't, it didn't crap or nothing, thank God. <laughs> He said it would uh it would have broken with that uh too much pressure on that uh, glue would have broken. So I, I hurry up and put all everything downstairs. If I do, got a mess in here. Oh. Ah, there's still my buddy's uh, dad is down or over, I should say, from Utah. So they're like out in the kitchen and they're talking. I'd love to go out there and show you what little bit I got going on. I did some wire management. They added the fish. What about tank me? I added Chato. I got the fuge light cranking. Murphy's Aquatics is in the chat. Murphy, what's up, buddy? I think Murphy's probably laying in bed. He's uh he is gotta be up early. Yeah, Murphy. Calypso was drilling his uh, off stream. He was uh, drilling his oh, tank. Oh, believe it or not, I was, I was going on another stream. Were you? Yeah. And you know what I did? I went to the bathroom, crawl under the the floor, and turn off the phone. <laughs> 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 so they don't see that. Like, all right, deuces. Nothing yeah. to see here. DC Reefer, what up, bro? DC got a nice setup. I like his his setup. Yeah, I've seen that before. Yeah, yeah DC Reefer. Thanks for the shout out, DC. Between you and Billy, I, I jumped like 50 on Instagram over the past couple of days. Appreciate you. What are you doing right now, Eclipso? I can take out the tape and I don't take the paint off. That was quick. Yeah. I never yeah, thought about I got, that. I, I, used... got the, I got the heater in the, on the bottom and then a fan blowing so it could dry faster. And the fan right here. That's the flex seal? What, what happened? That's the no, flex seal? He painted it. He oh, painted, he painted it. it. Oh, oh, I painted okay. it, yeah. yeah. The flex seal only going to do it where, where, where it cracked. That's it. What paint did you use? Just regular paint. Regular paint? Okay. Yeah, just regular paint. Easy to take out if, if I want to take it out. I I painted it earlier before um before I, I drilled it, <laughs> and when I was drilling it, the paint came off obviously. So I, I scraped it off and and messed it up. <laughs> Actually, messed it up. Basically. I could be all right, man. Now I'm about to do. It. Watch this. Now yeah, it's you, silicone for real. You won't put water in it right now. No, 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 no. Now this is dependent. I'm pretty sure there's like some kind of, well, I know there's something like, so obviously I'm in the car business and like when people get like chips in their windshield, there's like some kind of liquid that they like with like some kind of syringe pour in there and it doesn't like fuse it together, but it's like a super good bond. It stops it from um, cracking all the way we hit. Yeah, it stops it stops it from spreading. So I'm wondering yeah. if you could like it's probably you could probably Amazon it for mad cheap, but like just get that little syringe, try and get some of that stuff in the crack. Yeah. So the thing is it cracked like from here all the way like 
this whole corner right here. Yeah. So, you know, as long as this is all intact, uh, I'm, I'm trying to say, you know, once water go here, the only pressure is going to have it right here. So it might, you know, it might not affect it that much. We'll see. We're about to find out. I, I got I got good feeling. Unless I don't do pressure whenever I'm putting all the pipes together, you know, I mess it up again. Cause right now I got like when I when I uh, put the glue in, in, in the plexiglass, I put this too tight so I can just keep it together, you know. Well we'll see. It'll be okay. Yeah, like I said, I don't know how much pressure like if a 14 gallon, especially like with displacement. Yeah, yeah. What do you got? 10 gallons in it? So what are you gonna plumb that into the same sump? Yeah, for the same sump, yeah. But in the meantime, I'm just gonna like put the hang on the back filter on the other tank cycle. Just to get it running? Yeah, just to get it running so I can get more space to the seahorse, man. That thing is packed with I'm doing all this for the seahorse, that's it. And so where, where, where are you gonna where are you gonna put the seahorse in the display refugio? Yeah. Yeah, you're probably one of the only YouTube people on YouTube that has uh, that has like a reef tank with a with a seahorse in it. Yeah, they, they fun to have, man. I like them. Are they hard to keep? No, no. no. I mean, the the newest one. It took me like three days to get him to eat, but now he out compete the bigger one for food. Okay. Crazy. Yeah, uh, you gotta see this. Watch. Let me see if, if they eat something. Or not. But they, they like that little one is a savage when it comes to eating frozen brine shrimp. He's right there in, in the top, right there waiting for food. The big one is over there by the skimmer. Let's see if the little guy come and eat. There we go. Come on. There we go. Start swimming, you're not gonna get nothing. I can't even see it. Where, see where, where is it? Nah. I didn't know Here. you. I didn't know you got a second one either. Yeah, I got him like like. Oh, I see it right there at the top. Yeah, I see it at the top. Luckily. Oh yeah, there you go, right there. Yep. Yeah, the big one doesn't respond to food like him, or like her, whatever. Give it time. How long has he been in there? A week. A week. Yeah. But this one, like I was saying, this is the newest one, and this one's eating more. Like, I guess he go through the food, through the digestive system faster than the bigger one. The big one's a slow eater. Oh, so the little one's the new one. Yeah, yeah, that, that one's the new one. Yeah, the big one. Look out. Okay. Him. I don't know if you can see him, but he's look at the face right there. Yo, I first started watching your videos like only a few months ago when you had like the the brace on the the clown. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then, and then, like, and I remember, like, the seahorse would like attach to the brace, so I was like trying yeah, to swim yeah. around. That, that's why I think it didn't make it because the seahorse was just keep jumping on them, so it keep coming out off that brace. So I mean, I've seen a lot of things. I've seen a lot of things about like swim bladder that could have been an issue too. I don't really know a whole lot about it, but yeah. swim bladder seems to be like a big issue with fish. That kind of like, I don't know if they take like a big hit. Yeah, somehow. 
Yeah, I think I think it was my oh, fault. You need there. to get like a one fifty. Cause that night, I remember that night I started messing with the tank, fixing some corals in the back of the rock, and and he was back there. So I think I pinched him. You might have like smushed him somehow. Yeah, and then he was in the corner over there, just swimming sideways. Like, what the heck happened to this fish? Like they usually move out of the way when they, whenever they feel a rock moving or something. But I guess I got him good. I felt bad, man. I felt bad. I still feel guilty. Ugh, that was a ninety dollar fish. You know what I was gonna get today? Those those storm clowns. Yeah, what are those running you? Yeah. Eighty bucks a piece. The the black sword. No, they're more expensive. Those over here, um, the guy that got them, he won two fifty for the pair. Mike, you got challenge, man. Click that. I I can't even I can't even hold a candle to him, dude. Man. I got fish in my tank though. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, click clack. Come see me, bro. In time, I don't know. I, I could I could I mean my fish tank was alright last time. My reef tank was decent. I mean I had a pretty decent bout with green hair but once it just sucks because i had the green hair and then i did the flaconas on it cleaned everything up and then the thing was doing really well for a while and then um and then i had to move and that really i lost like four fish from the move a couple corals and then i i had it up and running for another four months and then broke it down and moved again it just sucked man because like it, it was it was finally to the point where it was like it was over a year old. It was starting to stable out. Like I didn't have to worry about a whole lot. It kind of ran itself and corals were doing good. Corals were happy and it just sucked that it just had to be broken down. Cause at first I didn't want to bring like, cause my, my, my fish tank is like between a hundred and hundred and at least, at least a hundred bucks a month in electricity. And I didn't want to bring that to my buddy's house that I'm moving into just right off rip here goes an, an extra 100 and whatever you know 100 bucks for the fish tank plus whatever i'm using yeah so this time i don't care i'll pay for it i'm doing all right i throw them an extra 100 bucks a month on uh, on top Be okay, Mike. We will be okay. We'll be all right. Yeah. We're gonna be okay. So when when um when you plan to come down here, whenever we go to Palooza, we're never on the corner. What what'd you say? When you come um plan to come down here, when we go to Palooza. Yeah, you're gonna ride out with me. Hell yeah. All right. Or are you driving? Yeah, I don't care, man. You go to New York, Florida, wherever you want. Either way, let's go. I, I'm, I definitely, I'm definitely going to wrap New York. I, did, I was going to go last year, and it was kind of like last minute, and I couldn't get the day off. But this, this time, I already got my ticket. Do you? I'll, uh, I'll buy mine right now. I don't care. Yeah, I, I said, I said, I'm not missing this one. <laughs> All right, I'll buy my ticket right now. Yeah, because that, that's the thing. If you wait for the last minute, then something come up, and you be like, ah. That's, that's what happened to me last year. I said, you know what, I'm gonna buy them. You know, I'm gonna wait to get closer. And at the last minute, I didn't, I didn't buy them. So the time I say, once they they throw that offer online, if you buy them, you get them for like what, fifteen dollars online. I'm, I'm just, by then I should be able to like buy some stuff because like I was at like I said, I went to the fish store yesterday in Rhode Island, and there was a bunch of stuff I wanted, but. I don't even have lights over my tank yet, so I couldn't buy another. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, take your time. You, you've been in, 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 in this before, so that's what I'm doing. I got all those corals there, but, man, once I get the bigger tank, you're going to see me, like, hand-picking everything I want for that tank. Like, that tank that you somebody was showing earlier, that, that was nice. Nice uh, and simple, you know? What are you talking about, Shy Towns Reef? I think so. Whoever was on with, the, with that tank. That was me. Yeah, yeah, I, was, yeah, I like that tank. 
Yeah, yeah. I, yeah. Maybe I just haven't been following Shy Town for that long, but I don't, I've never seen that tank, dude. They, they, you said something about the rock. Yeah, yeah, when he had all yeah. the blue pops, yeah, it's yeah. nice. I like it. Yeah, that, that is nice. So that's what I want. I want to be like, just pick the corals I want to make sure whenever the blue lights are on, it's going to look amazing. You know, like you're going to be like, holy shit. Yo, like, I, I, now I've that you're hearing... going to see a bunch of corals there, that's it. I've been hearing a lot of the people don't even bother with white lights much anymore. Because like what I used to do with my, with my, my four bulb T5 is that I had two blue plus running all day and then for like four hours a day I, I would have an aqua blue special and a purple plus i think yep. so like for a couple you know for a few hours a day it'd be like that white you know white light with no like not much fluorescent but mm-hmm. i guess like me just being out of the hobby or not out of the hobby but off of youtube and not like following along like brs and everybody yep. it seems like people run straight blues all day long straight blue yeah like we don't need the white Yo, hot but ass. Girls like I feel you, bro. Thing. I'm about to I'm about to put a video up calling click clack out. Yeah. <laughs> Clicks, what are you doing to Mike? It's gonna it's gonna be it's gonna be a there's gonna be a bunch of YouTube battles after Rico and uh, CJ. It's gonna be me and Click Clack. It's gonna be me and yeah. Nano because he got a 75. It's gonna be Shy Town's gonna be involved. Uh-oh. We're gonna have we're gonna have some some battles. The 75 gallon battle. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Hey, I'll probably join too. Run it. <laughs> yeah, I've been thinking. I've been thinking get back my seventy five. It's uh it's cool. It's just a lot of I mean it's it's just a lot of work. But that's the thing, when when I have my seventy five, like I don't know, I have skimmer, I have um UV, I have everything, the reactors and everything was going wrong. Chimp, I'm I'm the same way, man. When I, I got rid of my seventy five, it did like a I did like probably like nine or 10 months with just this little 28 that was like there. I think I did. I think I might've did two water changes in nine months yep. and I just didn't care. And then I was like, I started watching YouTube again. I got the fire back um, and I'm pumped, man. I can't wait. I just spent I know. a lot of money. I, I didn't spend, I mean, I can't say a ton. I mean, I did spend a lot of money, but not that much. I don't even know. When the most you have spent money right now is on the reactor, right? <laughs> Uh, on the calcium right. reactor, I spent three fifty on the calcium reactor, two forty on the Kimura. Uh, I spent like two something on the tank. Plus, you got the, the spent six hundred on the lights. But I mean, then there's a bunch of like little stuff: pumps, heaters. Yeah. Uh, I spent four twenty five on the Apex. Uh, I mean, and then like I bought so much little stupid BS like Wi-Fi surge protectors, uh, mm-hmm. uh, filter socks, and I just bought. Actually, this is this really really worked out for me. It was only like fifteen or twenty bucks, and you know those little clamps that everybody uses for like everything. Yep. I bought a, like it was like a twenty pack of different sizes, dude. I've used like oh, black clamps in the net. Just, just, no, just the little like squeeze little clamp. Yeah. It's a whole like a, different kind of size, small, medium, Yeah, large, it was only like 20 bucks or like yeah. 20 or 30 of them, and there's like five different sizes. Dude, I've used like four or five of them already. I just – yesterday when I was trying to get them – for uh, Sunday when I was trying to get them fish out, I clamped one. I clamped a filter sock so the water that I pour out would be filter socked, and then – and then I had a clamp holding the hose. Like, dude, everything I'm doing, I got two of them on the tank right now. I got it's just they're they're they work every oh, time. Those plastic ones. Yeah, and they're like super cheap, and they're a bunch yeah, of different yeah. sizes. So like, you can have the big ones that yeah, are like real ones, heavy, yeah. or like there's like these little ones that like yeah. just you know like yesterday I was acclimating them fish. Just took yeah. the little like yeah, little ones and clipped the bag on the side just so I could, just so I could uh, hold the bag on the side, you know. They, they they come in handy, that's for sure. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So uh, yeah, and, and but I I bought so much stupid stuff, but hey, that's all we do. I did have help <laughs> though, like I did have a lot of help with these wins that I've been getting. Like when I won that GHL, <laughs> when I won that GHL, that that helped out a lot. I basically bought the lights, the calcium reactor, media, the tank. I bought. Because I got eleven fifty back from that, so I I, I, yeah. I balled out for a minute. Yeah. But you know, it's just like before I know, it, like I just uh, I bought another Wi Fi surge protector, another thirty bucks. You don't even think about all these little, little, uh, little 
purchases I make, you know, it'd just be like 20 bucks here, 40 bucks here, 30 bucks here. Yeah, I, know. I know it. I yeah, spent I, know. I spent 300 in a week on all this little crap. Mm-hmm. Yeah, every, like, every week I always go and buy something. I'll, I'm always needing something. Click Clack says he's got a video coming tomorrow. Uh, I better be ready. He's going to start the video <laughs> squeezing lemons. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> uh, yo, Clack. Clack, I, I don't really care about nothing else right now. I'm a. This, fa- this fish tank, I'm going to call it Click Clack. Click Clack. Click Clack's demise. <laughs> I could, I could totally fail, but I, th- I think I'm set up. This for- it, have any of you guys tried this before? Oh, yes. uh, that's yeah. I used, I used that and Doctor Tim's on my tank right now. Yeah, that's it. It, I mean, have, have you seen any improvement in, in the? I mean, I can't say it didn't work, but I have seen no issues. Like I've only had fish in the tank for two days and. Yeah, yeah. Every, I mean, not everybody's doing fine. One of the new fish is just like laying there, but yeah. everybody else, my my old my fish from my little tank, they're all money right now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I, I mean, I added some because remember those rocks? They throw a lot of dye off on them. Hey, Shy Town, I saw in your your eighty you just showed a little bit ago. You have the um those little bio balls, the little uh chemi or uh, marine pure spheres. Pure. Yeah. I ran those last time, and I felt like there was so much detritus under them. Do you not? It's so getting dark, real dark, yeah. So what do you do? Do yeah. you just leave it, or you take them out? I just left it there. Uh, Click Clack says he's calling everybody out in his weight class. You can't call me out, bro. I'm like 225. <laughs> unless, you're talking about, unless you're talking about 75, then you can call me out all you want. You How long you had you running with that? Say it again. How long you had to run it with the the bio balls? I don't have them now, but I had. Um, I don't know. I probably. I mean, I only had mine about uh, maybe five or six months. That I probably something like that, like six, yeah. seven, eight months, something like that. And they, they get darker. They, yeah, they do. Oh, absolutely, they did. Um, I thought about like when I when I did that bleach bath with my rock. I thought about throwing them in there, uh, but then I kind of like started really thinking about it, and like I didn't like that, like. If you like, I used to, I used to throw, um, Ooh, girl, bend over. Uh, I used to have, um, like frag plugs in my sump with the Marine pier and mm-hmm. like, I'd reach in there and like have to, cause they'd fall to the bottom. So I'd reach in there after like grab one out and it would just throw up like a cloud of just detritus and it would end up getting in my, in my main display. So I think this time I'm going to go I, I have a rock in there I put in the other day just for a little added bacteria on like a, on an established rock because the rock that I have in my 28 and that one rock that I put in my sump is probably like two years old. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So it's established, you know, I actually noticed I, this is just because I pulled it out and like inspected some of it. It's cool that I got like three different colors of purple uh, on it. And I actually noticed some like yellow sponges, which I, I thought about like fishing them out and trying to throw them in the new tank, but. Whatever. Yeah. Yo, click clack. Talking about waves. We we ain't talking about your hair, bro. Hey, click clack got waves on swim. My, I don't, I don't, I don't have waves. This is nappy. Yo, click clack. Let's let let's see let's see. Come on. Talking all this ish. Come on with it. Come on with it. There's your link right there, bro. Come see me, son. Let's see what you got. What could have been going in his tank? Nothing. Click back thinks he's tough because he got a calcium reactor running. Oh, <laughs> that's why. That's it. That's all he got. <laughs> man, Mike, when you pulled that calcium reactor out, I'm like, man, that looked complicated. All those tubes. It's, it's really not, though. Like, once hey. you, like... That's what everybody says. Like BRS is the same thing. Everybody says like, "Don't be scared." Lights out. I don't care. Throw a flashlight up. Click that. Um, that's what everybody says. Like calcium reactors are so complicated, but everybody's saying they're really not, and they're really not. Like no, my that's calcium, the one you got. My calcium reactor is overcomplicated, 
because it's got so it's got like a it's got like a whatever the co2 runoff or whatever you want to call it like an exhaust basically it's got more tubes than like a geo because geos are super simple yeah um yo silicone that to the back you'd be straight <laughs> you know you know this one huh because i know you had this one before what do you mean like uh, you didn't they didn't give you this one or you had the h2o you did have the h2o my overflow yeah before, no I... you had the h2o no, I didn't. No, I had uh, I, uh, I just said it earlier. Um, oh yeah, yeah, the gold, right? I had the Ghost Overflow by Modular Marine, which took yeah. forever to get. Yeah, yeah, this is the one that comes with the H two O overflow that I had in the forty gallon breeder. So the reason I bought what I bought for a calcium reactor is because I wanted one with a dual chamber, and even though my dual chamber isn't that big. I wanted one and like looking at the other stuff, I didn't want to go super cheap, but I obviously, I mean, I could have went expensive, but like, I don't want to spend like a G note on something like a geo or like something crazy. Um, so I ended up just buying that. I thought it was a good alternative to, to what I was looking for. Um, so I ended up buying that. And like, so far, as far as the actual reactor, uh, I like the actual reactor. I think it looks cool. Um, but the pump is lacking. So like at this point, because, because I um, got this stupid pump crap going on, I'm thinking about like, I don't know. Do I, do I just get another same pump that it came with and deal with the crap? Or do I like, upgrade to like a name brand even though i guess skims is a name brand but like something like off i don't know plumbing in another pump somehow like a reliable pump something that has like a reputation of reliability. Yeah, I get good. yeah i get something good you know like even if i don't even if it's not that much but like even something like a little maxi jet. I don't know if that's powerful enough to run through. But as you guys seen on these BRS videos, it doesn't matter how much water you're running through it. It's all basically it's all about like the pH and how much you're melting. You could be running a million gallons through it, but, but if it's not, if the pH isn't melting, then it doesn't matter. Yeah. Click Clack says he's got some secret water. Speaking of water, I'm thinking about. Which I need to. I haven't. I haven't. Um, I haven't changed my RODI everything in. I, I think I changed, I, I changed it once in two years, so it's probably about time. I have to do that too. That's another expense, dude. I'm like looking at like <laughs> replacing it's six expensive. stages, dude. It's like eighty bucks to it just just for like these stupid little foam things and some balls. Like, you know, the only thing I changed. The carbon and the and the white one. The carbon block. Yeah, and the obviously the the di whenever it just turned brown, that's it. I haven't changed the main brain or or the third one. I have, I don't even know what the third one is made. So so mine goes through the. Th what do you have? A three stage. The mine. Yeah. Six. That's what I got. I got a max spec, or not a max spec, the max max water. It smells like. Mine is liquid gen. Liquid gen. Liquid gen. Something like that. Buckeye Reef. Buckeye. Some Buckeye. Damn. Yo, Clack, why don't you hit that link, bro? Don't talk about it. Be about it. He's scared. Don't talk about it. Be about it. There you go. I was like, damn, I saw something. Burning. It smells like forest fire. I forgot I got the window open. Should have got an Aquamax. You should have. Should have get got your money up before you purchased. Does smell good though. My room smells like forest fire. Hold on. I don't know what you're doing. You're showing me that. What is it? What's inside the cube, Calypso's? That's for the giveaway. Yo, step aside. You boys got it. It's a cube. Step aside. That's step aside. I'm a shoe in. 
Bro, I haven't had a chance to make no videos. I've been in the hospital in and out. Oh, uh, with the wifey, right? Yeah, bro. She just went today for another surgery. We was there on Thursday for surgery. She got out the same day. Um, we went back the next day because um, she couldn't breathe. We got out the same day. Then um, she went yesterday to an appointment. And she all right? Yeah, she's good. Yeah, she just had an hernia in, in one of the surgery things they did there. So. Yeah. Well, I hope she's doing all right. Yeah, no, no, but she looked way better now. She looked way better now. But three surgeries. Well, back to your man. subscribers, not to not to change subject. I remember when you was like stressed and you had like seven. You're like, yo, got to give away coming at 100. I'm like, bro, don't don't sweat. You'll be at 100 real quick. Now you're at like two some, aren't you? Three. Three some. There you yeah. go. Yeah, G. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> What oh. it do, click clack? What you what do, up? Bro? What up? What up? Yo. What it do? What it do? Yeah, you talking all the junk? You bro. talking oh, all that oh. junk, bro? Oh 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 man, I can't wait to smash that ass. Challenge, <laughs> man. You can't even get the octopus to work, man. <laughs> no, I, I don't know what you're talking the about. Octopus, octopus. Got, the name? Nope, I got a uh, Skims. Man, you paid all that money for a piece of junk. Nah, son. Like, I, I, when I was talking to BRS, women. I think BRS was just like copping out. They're like, oh, you know, I did a little research on our products, and I was looking at, I was looking at our calcium reactors, and from what I hear, I guess cal- the calcium reactor pumps are a little loud when you initially set them up. They're trying to get the air out. I'm like, yeah, that's why I ran it for three days before I, I, I emailed you, and I didn't like. I must have got like a faulty. So I don't know that. You know when you when you you know when you plug in a, a hang on the back filter and it's got, it's like real loud until it catches. That's exactly what mine sounded like. So I took it apart, which I shouldn't have to, but I took it apart. And in the process of like, I inspected it. You know, I was like, I, I don't see nothing wrong. Like, not that I'm an expert. You hear that? So we're putting it back together. It. Putting it back together, it cracked. Like son of a bitch. All right. Like I said, don't talk about it. Be about it. What's up? Yo, Mike, you hear that? No. <laughs> That's probably it's the call right? silence. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, why don't you turn your turn your uh, why don't you turn your uh, camera on and let me see what you're talking about? I don't I care. See, Oh, thank you. I told you my lights going off, man. Yeah, you see, count them bubbles, Mike. That's only one chamber, right? That's one chamber. What's your? My pH inside my tank is eight point two. Is it? How are you doing that? I ain't doing nothing. I'm letting it, I'm letting it do its thing, man. Oh, yeah. How old's your tank? Inside my six point nine right now. Oh, so you're running so you're so you're running so you're not even what's your out at? My out and my tank is at ten. And how are your corals reacting to it? Hey, mine's not fifteen. Just lovely. Everything's still growing and crusting. Where are you at? Where are you at? South Carolina? North Carolina. North Carolina. So it's not, it's just, so it's probably decent weather out right now. You got the windows open or something? Nah. Nah. How the hell are you running at 8.2 then? Man, I don't know. I don't know. You it's just get lucky. There you go, bro. Just it's get a miracle. Lucky. I know. Because when I was running my, when I was running my old tank, like, I remember we got a bunch of heated arguments because I was like, I didn't really know. I was trying to like chase numbers and shit. So like I was at like 7.6 and I'm like freaking out. Like I need to change this. I'm buying, I'm buying CO2 scrubbers. I'm opening windows. I'm running tubes out the window. Like clack, pull the camera sideways. Or the phone. There we go. There we go. Oh, my 
Yeah, my lights are going off, man. I ain't, I ain't very colorful right now. Yeah, how'd you, how old's your tank, you say? Uh, Going on, what, eight months? So it's fairly new, though. Yeah. In no time, Mike. In no time. How many, how many fish you got in there? I only got five in here, Mike. Are they you little? Know, I had, like, you know, I had, like, 12, and... I had uh velvet and it yeah, killed a, yeah. a good bit of them. Uh, so I added some anthias a few weeks ago, and they all didn't make it. So yeah. anthias, anthias stuff. So like when I moved, and we, we was talking about that a minute ago, uh, when I lost some fish when the first time I moved my seventy five, like I had two anthias in there. I had a male and a female, and they were awesome, dude. They would just like school swim around together. They were all over the place. Uh, that that was that that sucked when I lost those guys because they're they're really colorful, really the really personalities were awesome. So I'm yeah, thinking about I'm thinking about getting, getting those guys. In New York, you got to see the ones they got being. Where? In New York. Oh, that little shop you went to the, the little yeah. while ago. Yeah, I'm going back this weekend. So, all right, that's it. That's it, Shot Town. I mean, that's it, uh, Click Clack. That's all you got. I might let you see a little something. Coming at me with all that talk, and that's all you got. <laughs> that's all, right, all I got. All right, then. That's all all right. I, got, I see you, bro. <laughs> when, when, that's when, all when, I need. So we, That's so we all I need to take you out, Mike. That's all I need to take you out, Mike. So we couldn't really see because it, it was dark. You got any sticks in there? You got any sticks in there? You go. No, no sticks. Yeah, few sticks in there. Do you need a sticky? Yeah, I got a. I, I got a few. When did when did you when did you feel comfortable out of them? Man, you know I added my sticks like two weeks after I put my tank together. Two weeks, dude. I'm scared. <laughs> yeah, and the first one of one of the first that I added was that Walt Disney. And it's doing fine, right? Yeah. How's growth? Is it growing? Oh yeah, you see the nubs are starting to no yeah. about back there. Yep. And it was a tiny little bug. It was like that one right there. Tiny little bug. You can see it. I got one that uh fell off the rock and kind of started receding, but it's look like it's gonna make it. That's tight though. What's that big red thing right there? It's a ball sponge. What? Yeah, right. Ball sponge. It's a ball oh, sponge. Okay, okay. I've seen them before. Yeah, I never seen that before. Yeah, I seen them in, in this shop over here. And you got some some storm oh, clown. Yeah, I got some mochas. Yeah, you got money. Uh, Calypso's in the market. Yeah, you got money. How much you pay for those clowns, boy? Uh, I got. These two for like one fifty. One fifty, yeah. That's a hit, though. Yeah, it is. It is the cheaper. I find them online is for for one seventy nine, one eighty a pair. You know what I don't care for, and they're stupid expensive right now. They're like those long, called a yeah, long the long now. fins. Yeah, long fins. Like I don't like that. No, yeah, they like ugly. That. Looks like a goofy ass beta. Yeah. I don't like them, and they're like they're like in right now. I don't care for them. Yeah, I I, I like the 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 black stone. Those are fire. They go like little pandas. I got my eye on uh, a, a uh, clam when I'm ready. I, I kind of I never I always thought they were kind of kind Boring. of stupid, I guess. But the more I see them, the more I like it. Yeah, yeah. So we'll yeah, see. I, I wanna I'm gonna be particular about the coral I put in this tank now. 
because before I, I thought I was being per, you know, particular, but I was just like throwing almost anything in there. Yeah. You know, you go to the fish store and it was like all impulse, like, oh, it kind of looks cool. And then you get it home and a couple of weeks later, like, man, I don't even like that. Yeah. yeah. yeah yep. Are, That's where I was on this thing. I was like, not add no green. And I'm adding mostly name brand coal. Not a bunch of those. Just random coal. You know, right. if I had this something frag, I want to be able to make some money. Yeah, the green is the cheap stuff. Yeah, yeah. No, nah, not always. That's no, what not I like. Exactly, not always. It's all the that's time. what I like about. That's what I like about you, Clip. So, like, I don't want to make a trip down to you until I got something to bring with me. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah. I don't want to just come down there and clear out your tank and grab oh, four or five good, frags man. and then, you know. You'd be good. I would do the same thing once your tank is full. Yeah, you're gonna come. To, yeah, you're gonna come to me. <laughs> yeah, I go to you. Okay. I should have stopped. I should have stopped by your spot on my way to Pennsylvania, but I went mad early. Yeah. And on the uh, way home, yeah, I just, just, just on the way home, I just wanted to get home. By Palooza, by Palooza, you ready for some calls in that? I hope so. Yeah. We'll Yo, see. if 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 my boy um um E Money from Aquarium Monster, he he bought one of those BG that he got in the nanotech that he just set up. And he that already, tank, he basically bought it and set it up. He already got like sticks in it. And he already got sticks in it. Yeah, Mike, all of you scared. Yeah, exactly. You don't scared one, Mike. I don't, don't, like, well, don't want to kill stuff. Yeah, I feel you. I feel you. It's sad when they die. I've killed a lot of people in my day. You ain't the only one, Mike. What's up? Say, so you're not the only one. I didn't kill home records and WDs before. Yeah. I, uh, like I said, I want to be particular this time. Like, I go to the fish stores and, like, I see some cool stuff, but, like, it, until I have, like, until I start placing pieces, I can't, I feel like I can't figure it out because, like, I don't, like, the last time I would, ha- I had, like, a brown stick over here followed by, like, a purple stick over here. And like uh, a torch in the middle, like you know, I want to, I want to be particular about it this time. Yeah, believe it or not, I got thirty something coal in my tank, and it doesn't even look like it. So yeah, yeah. When I had my seventy five, I probably had like forty or fifty, and like most of them were frags, and they just like didn't even come close to even slightly filling up the tank. Yeah, yeah. That's why I'll be getting to now, like getting bigger colonies, man. So whenever I get a bigger tank, at least it looks decent, you know? Yo, here in a little bit. Yeah, I want to. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm listening. Go ahead, Clack. You want to what? I right, muted him, so. Unless I muted him. Nope, there you go right there. Um <laughs> In here a little bit. So, like I said, my, my my roommate's dad's here from Utah, so they're, like, out there hanging out. Um, but he's got, like, a 12-year-old. My, my buddy's brother is, like, 12, so it's almost 11. They'll probably be heading out soon. So I'll go out, I'll go out there and show what I got going on. It's not a whole lot. Not a whole lot, but we'll see what I got going on. Yo, what do you want? Uh, yeah. Clyde. You are you running? You're running like a cheap so not can't say cheap, but like a, just a generic solenoid like me, right? Like solenoid and and all that. You're yeah, not, I'm running the 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 regular stuff. Yeah. What'd you spend? I spent like one ten or fifteen on mine. See, you had to spend all that. I bought mine in a package deal. I bought a calcium reactor. Oh, you got yours used. pH you got controller. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, you and all of that for two fifty. Yeah, exactly. And I and I and I ended up spending what seventy five dollars. So I spent. I mean, my... So I spent three fifty on the reactor, two forty on the Kimura. I what bought the, what, whatever the, the reboot. Yeah, I bought. I bought. I bought. The solenoid for one fifteen. I bought reborn media. I bought the cow or the cow mag. 
and then I bought the brand new CO2 tank. So three fifty, four fifty, five fifty, call it six, seven. I'm probably into my calcium reactor for like eight fifty. Whoa. I know, stupid money. Yeah. I know. And it's one of these things where I didn't even think about it when I bought it. I just like was like piecing stuff together. I'm like, all right. You know, because I, I didn't, it didn't happen overnight. So I'm like, all right, you know, I, I bought this thing for, for a little bit of money. And then two weeks later, I'm like, all right, let me spend a couple hundred bucks. I got a little money. And then two weeks after that, I'm like, all right, let me, you know, let me buy this some more. <laughs> yeah. You don't even I feel they, they start adding up. Yeah. Yeah. I might end up getting a uh, carbon dose to make life a little bit more simple. Me too. I haven't even used mine yet, but we'll see. Your rock's green, huh? Look at that sponge, though, dude. That shit's bright, huh? What, what's the name of that sponge? Uh, it's called a ball sponge. The ball sponge? Red ball sponge. Uh, are they expensive? I paid, like... Five bucks for that sponge. Oh, shit. Wow. It's Uh, Hot Asha says, uh, Click Clock, what is the challenge based upon? I said, it's based upon whose looks better. We'll see how it goes. And I said, Clack has stacks to spend. I got rolls of quarters. Nah. <laughs> I'm broke. I'm broke, man. There's the guy who's only going name brand. I'm broke. Yo, That's why I'm you, broke. Weren't you talking la like uh, last the last time we streamed, you were on here about like some big system you're about to spend? Yeah, right. <laughs> it was like a 400 gallon or something. Now, nah, I'm actually probably going to just stick to probably like a 120, something like that. See, if I keep if it I, light, if I, if I my next tank is going to be a six foot, if I do it at another tank, like I want to have some bigger fish, like I want like a couple show fish in there. Like, I really like a like a blonde naso tank, like, I like those, those a lot. Yeah, I want to be able to have a life outside of the fish tank. Yeah, I'm the same way, but like <clears throat> all my all my other hobbies are fairly cheap. Like fit, like I like to fish. I bought a boat last year, so it's like I got a boat. You know, I got my fishing pole. I got everything I need, so that's fine. Yeah, but, you know, it's like I, I I video game. Like, what's that cost me? Sixty bucks every time I want to buy a new game. So it's like I don't have any other really expensive hobbies. So I got expensive hobbies. They call kids. I got one too, bro. I got four. I know. <laughs> uh, I don't know about that. <laughs> he say that's it. That's it. <laughs> Damn, Dang, Calypso. <laughs> Yeah, well, you talking? You got a six piece over there. Right? Oh, you no, got a, I, only, I only have, I only got two. You got a basketball team with a couple subs. Yeah, my mine is already <laughs> nineteen and ten years old. You got yeah, I got an eighteen old. year old. Man, y'all both old as hell. <laughs> 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 nice joke. <laughs> I'm thirty like eight, brother. You like Bobby? You damn near Bobby. I, I'm, <laughs> I'm about to turn 30. Yeah. Man. How old are you, Click? Oh, like? yeah. You older than me. I'm 36. Yeah, yeah I just turned uh, 31 in February. Yeah. Uh -huh. mm. Oh, yeah. You got stacks to blow. No, I don't. I got, a, I, got a, I got one. She's almost six in June. She'll be six in June. Oh, but you got I'm, stacks to blow. No, she's going to private school. Uh -huh, which, you, got oh, stacks. you don't have any no, stacks to blow. No, it wasn't my it wasn't my suggestion. Her mom put her there, and then now we're keeping her there. And 
I didn't agree with it because I ain't trying to pay for it. But in the long run, I guess I'd rather be broke and my daughter have a, a setup that's you know, decent. Whatever. Yeah. I pay. True. I pay enough in child support to to help out with that anyway. So you pay child you, support and school. Uh, child support is part of my school, or oh, okay. school is part of my child support. Oh, okay. But now we got summer camp coming up, and we right, just yeah. threw five fifty towards that. That'll help. That's part of the team. Uh, we'll see. She's crazy, but it's cra- it, it's crazy, dude. You uh, kids are kids are nuts. K time. Well, I, you well, guys. I be crazy. getting a little bit of money back out of this one. Man, you about to get like eight grand back from all them things you got. Nah, I wish. I got, um, so what? What we did is 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 we we were actually pretty good trying to do the whole child support court case thing. We um we split like taxes. We split. I you know I, I was told I got to pay child support, but like the taxes were split. Um, I I pay for aftercare three days a week. So like she she claimed that. And she gave me that money, but basically all the money, all the money I got back, I basically gave it to her and told her to like keep some for summer camp, and let me let me catch up a few few weeks on or you know over you know pay forward a couple weeks. So I'm all right. So it's nice. This is week Friday will be week three that I don't have to pay child support. So it's 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 pretty nice actually. I just this is random. I just bought a DC reefer post on his Instagram. About the the Hannah salinity checker, I just I just ordered that yesterday. It's like seventy bucks, but we'll see. Damn, it must be nice to have seventy bucks to just order salinity checker. <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah. Better get on my level, bro. I I I deal with the uh, with the rest. Here. That's it. Well, the, the oh, reason the reason I ordered that, uh, and, and this is in all. Uh, let me back up. Uh, K Town, I knew what you were talking about. Um, I knew you were talking about uh, A. Uh, but yeah, the reason I bought that is because I have like the little refractometer, and uh, like I don't trust it. And maybe mine's it mine's like two, three years old, so maybe I need a new one. But like I would pour the the the, the calibration solution on it, and I would bring it down to 1.026 and then I'll run I'll run my my tank water on it and then like within you know right after I run the tank water I'll clean it off and then I'll put the calibration solution back on it and I'll leave it and it's off already all in the matter of like five minutes so, oh Mike you can't be throwing it around I don't throw it around I just use it but I'm saying, like I said, I would literally put the calibration solution on it, dial it in, calibrate it, check my water, and then throw calibration solution back on it, and it's off again. So it's like, I don't trust it. Which one do you have? Uh, whatever, like Amazon. I mean, I don't even know. It's like three years old. Oh. Well, you bought the cheap shit, right? <laughs> it was like 30 bucks. It wasn't that. I mean... <laughs> I mean, you get what you pay for, Mike. Well, that's why I just spent 70 bones and got the Hannah. <laughs> oh, man. So I don't even know what my salinity is right now, to be honest with you. Yo, question. You think if I cut this through here like that, it will still work? The light? What is that? This is a LED panel. Uh, this is bullshit right here. What do you think if you cut it? Yeah, if it'll if still I, work. No, no, I don't think so because the wires are all the the lights are all connected somehow. Yeah, so I mean, you, I see the I see the like the little um whatever you call that the rail. Yeah, but if you, order. I don't know. I mean, you may be able to cut it in the other half work. I don't know. I, I wouldn't. Why? Oh would you yeah, I got, I got you. I got you. Cause they they connect somehow. They keep going. Around they have to. Yeah. So yep. what, what, what are you trying circuit. to do with that? Um, cause I want to convert this light into a refusion light. So what's the problem with that panel you just showed us? With this one? Yeah. What are you trying to do? Get Cut the off lights from, from here and put them in here. So why don't you just. So I can have it more smooth. 
neat like. So why don't you just glue that whole panel right to that bracket? <laughs> like that? No, the other way. <laughs> like that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mike Lennon. What's the problem? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> if you're not going to use the light, what does it even matter? It. He's got a 14-gallon... <laughs> He's got a 14 gallon refugium, so it's, it's like, yeah, bro. this wide. So, what's the matter? <coughs> I want it to look like this. You want it to look neat, presentable. More money then. Hey, quick back, you get what you pay for. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, it's a hard to change this light. And let's say if I want to change the light and order some lights online, say it again. It's it hard to change them. Let's say I want to change it. Let's say some of them got messed up. I want to replace them. Man, that sounds like a job for Johan. It's probably yeah, above I, your I pay like grade, bro. My, my father, my father, um, do that. He fixed TVs and all that bullshit. All right. So then, why don't you just have him build you one then? What are you doing, bro? If I already got it in my hand, well, I gotta send this to Puerto Rico and then wait for it to come back. Well, you got still going be. But I, I order one online. I just wanna, Uh-oh. you know, have a cool project to do. How to upgrade uh, uh, cheap light, Aquan. Get rid of that thing and buy what I got. It was thirty bucks <coughs> on Amazon. Which, well, I got these. You know, I got this bulb. So that's a part thirty-eight. Yep. So I bought, I bought a hundred. I think it was hundred and fifty watts. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. I saw your light. Yeah, I saw it. I got about a hundred and fifty watt uh, UFO grow light last time. That that shit cranked. Like I got my chato chato growth. My chato growth was insane. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, But I didn't like it because a lot of people were talking about fire hazards, um, and it mine actually really it got really loud. Exactly. Yeah, mine got really loud. Yeah. So I didn't I didn't like it. It was like really loud. Yeah, I did disconnect the fan and put a fan outside. Right? That's what somebody else was doing. Uh, or they like upgraded the fan to like a computer fan. Yeah. Um. So what I did this time is I found another light. Uh, nah, I was boiling water. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we know. Uh, so mine I fell in the water. So I bought and uh, this time I bought. It gets really hot from what I hear, and even the top has a sticker like "Don't touch it." But I bought it was I think it was something like twenty five thirty bucks on Amazon. It's another, uh, it's a cob light this time, mm-hmm. so I got to run it right now. And I haven't touched it yet. I, I'm I'm thinking about it just to see. But I, I probably could take the lights from me a little. They easy to take out. Yeah. Good luck. <laughs> you see? Whoa. Yeah, I see it. Yeah, yeah. They're no, not you plug see. and play. I'm about to burn the house. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I mean, you can use anything for for a refugium. Just I know, I know. I just like the like the grow with with the red pink light. It, it's, it yeah, fantastic. I'll show you what I bought right now. Let me yeah, do I saw this. It. You saw what I got? Yeah, I saw it the other day when you were showing the, the tank. The little yeah. one, this little square light. Yeah, let's check it out. Hold on, let me that's see. a that's a like a fuck light, right? Uh, Fog light, that's how they call that. Well, I'm not saying not it right. Not a fog light, but um... <laughs> I'm not saying it right. You know my English, bro. Let me show you how much stupid fish tank shit I ordered. Look, I ordered this today, so I'm gonna have another one of those coming. So here's those little clips I was talking about. Like, dude, these, yeah, these yeah. things are money. Yeah, Fifteen fifty. It's wow. a 16 piece. You know, these things are money. I love them. Um, but that's not what we're talking about. This is going to be like way far. Look at all this Amazon. Look at look at all my orders. This is like recent too. Yeah. We'll go to page three and it's last month. Of not It's like 32 days ago. This was a good buy. I like these little guys. 23 bucks for some under, under lights. Yeah. Cool. It's just so much fish tank stuff. I know, man. I'm looking. You look at my talent, look the same way. <laughs> he buying all that stuff, and I'm gonna whoop you with driveway. <laughs> <crap>. <laughs> you better put some miles on that. <laughs> 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 all 
right here. Thirty-one, thirty-two dollars. CF grill, hundred watt. Yeah. Cob light. It's waterproof. So that was one of the reasons why I bought it. It's a hundred watt, full spectrum. Yeah. I gotta see that. I gotta see that on. Yeah. I, I think those are the ones that uh, SC Reefer had bought. A couple people I've seen use them. They say it works great. So I don't know. For the price of thirty two dollars, like I think. All right, so my my birthday's coming up, brother. <laughs> Mike spending all that money. Yeah, you about to be bouty. That 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 guy be winning all the giveaways, man. <laughs> yeah, I told him already. He's not allowed to enter my giveaway. He might win it. Too. Yo. Mike has the best luck ever. Oh, wow. I don't though. Yo, I gambled today. I lost forty bucks. Yesterday, I lost forty bucks. I don't, Mike. You gained over a thousand with the controller. More than that. <laughs> okay. And then I won. Yeah, I don't know, man. I I can't explain it. I don't win. I don't win much, but I have been winning. I know. Yeah, I, I have terrible luck, so I don't even enter these contests. Anymore. Dude, I well, that's your problem. Like, you, can't fuck it. You, you can't win if you don't enter. Can't win if fuck you don't it. play. Dude, the, the the first one, that GHL, I totally forgot there was even a contest for GHL. It was comment on the video. I commented and then got a, a, an email three weeks later, and I didn't even know there was a contest going on. I totally forgot. The BRS. Dang. BRS does a contest every week. And uh, you just type yeah, it in. Yeah, I've been email. hitting them up. Yeah. And then that other one, the, the last one I won uh was the only was the only one that I actually put in some like effort. Calypso, what do you know about this? About what? An unopened. Ah, that's what I want. Back to S1. Unopened. Got the steel right there. Hey. So this is the only thing I actually put in effort for, besides like yeah. submitting an email. Like that's all. Hey, I got, I got put some if I was a ghost, I flip your chair over, Mike. Oh, don't even make me turn my camera and show you all the BRS <laughs> stuff I got. You heard, right, Mike? What's up? I can put some effort to get it from your hand. I got, I got good. You have to put in more than you got. <laughs> 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 what do you? What would you use it on? Huh? What, what would you, you use it on? On oh, seventy-five. That's the small one, right? The small. That's the small. That's the small. I don't know. Not, I don't know nothing about it. I just know what it, it yet? I just know what it costs. Have you opened it yet? Nope. No? Oh, Sticker okay. still on it. All right. Sealed. They sent you a brick in the box. That, it could be. That's like an iPhone. <laughs> thing, huh? <laughs> yeah, they got like some rocks and like a couple PVC pipes in here. You imagine? It doesn't even like say what it's rated for. You you imagine if you open that thing and that's what it's like. <laughs> <laughs> well, can it be PVC? Like, gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> it says, bad. so it says up to 1,400 gallons per hour. Yeah, you could do it. You could do it. Well, you could call it. You could do eleven twenty gallons per hour with three three foot of head pressure. Okay. Yeah. Fourteen hundred gallons is like no head pressure. No. So if you did like eight hundred and forty, or uh, call it, call it five hundred gallons of head pressure at like, or five hundred gallons an hour at like four and a half to five head pressure. I mean, it's cool. I thought about using it. Yeah. A lot of people are saying, why don't I take my JMO off and put this on? I'm just scared of Vectra. Or uh, the, the, the Vectra S1. I've seen, and this is just like completely recent, I've seen a couple of people that are like, these pumps suck. You know, I've had I've had Milwaukee's that ran for 10 years and they were perfect. Okay. This thing runs for a year and shit out on me. Like, I don't want to deal with that. Yeah. I mean, yeah, yeah. the, the JMO. Yeah, I've, I've heard that. The J-Bow I have right now, I got probably two and a half years ago. 
And Travis and Chris the Hex, this was his old pump, and he ran it for like a year and a half. So this thing, it took a year off, but it's been running for like four years, and that thing's still money right now. So like, I, I, I'm a firm believer in Jabo. Like people, I've seen like you do like Amazon reviews. People are like, oh, it sucks, it shit out of me. I've never had man fuck Jabo. Never. I just bought some new power heads, and them shits already did. What you bought, Jabo? Did you bought do some it? SW SW eight? So I have, and they already eight. didn't kick the bucket. I know I have an RW eight right now, and whatever like the gyre one is, I got them running. They're totally fine. I got a pump. I got the return pump. I think I got an RW eight. I like them. Yeah, I bought the new model ones, the the SW and the PPs, and they I was crappy. Oh, this is a PP eight. I think I got, I think I got the RW8 this time because the PP8, the pp is. I, I have a, I have two spare PP8s downstairs. One of yeah. them did, one of them did crap out on me, mm-hmm. but that was because I, 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 I chalk it up to, I took it offline for the past year, and then I tried cranking it up. I only can get one working, but they were in in the shed. It gets cold up here, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. So I don't know what happened. The other one took a little finesse, but it, it, it cranked up again. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so I'm thinking about switching to the uh Skims version of the Oh, oh there, you go. there you go. Tell yeah. you about Skims and now you about to go to Skims, huh? Man, I mean I got a Skims return pump. I got yeah. a Skims squad pump. You like it? Yeah. Oh hell yeah, that mode is solid. And it got like thirteen foot of head pressure or something like that. I mean yeah. it's a I beast. Even, I don't even know how to calculate that, to be honest with you. Any idea yeah. how to calculate head pressure? Nope. Me either. Because my return, my return goes up about probably, if I had to guess, 15 inches. It goes back about a foot and a half and then goes up about two feet. Well, that's about four foot. So where you just count it and that's what your head pressure is? I reckon so. But don't, but doesn't like uh, bends in the PVC and doesn't have a fan. Yeah, but I also heard that the bands don't affect the flow. I don't know anything about it. Yeah, I'm not a plumber. We need pipes. And yeah, we need Billy, that yeah. I was. Uh, I talk to Billy all the time, he, and we, we were talking the other day. Um, I think I think he's gonna send me a uh, basically like an attachment to tap into my to my um my sink because i have and under my sink like there's a couple drawers where like i basically keep everything but under my sink is like some detergent and like some dryer sheets and like that's it i'm like wide open so excuse me i'm thinking about i'm thinking about having tapping into like the copper or i might not even have to and, and actually like hard plumbing my RDI into my into my sink because oh, right yeah. now, literally right now, and it's sitting like it like it is right now. I have it on a windowsill, draped out. the 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 exit, the the dirty water is just pouring out on the lawn, and and the other one, the inlet, is just attached to the hose right next to the window. Mm. So, I've only I've only. I don't want to say flooded, but I've only um, overflowed once so far. And at my old house, I did it. I probably overflowed a few times. Like I, you know, how many times like I would be running RDI and I would fall asleep <laughs> in like in like a six <laughs> gallon or like a ten gallon brute, and I wake up and there's like twenty gallons all before. That sucked. Oh yeah. Uh, which which is a segue oh, to yeah, that, to that ROGI flood, the flood the flood guardian I was looking at the other day. It's like, again, it's stupid more stupid money, but it's kind of like a savior. You know, if I spend whatever it is like seventy, eighty, hundred bucks, and I can get the flood guardian, I might do that. I don't know. I, I feel like there's always something to buy, man. Like always something to make my life easier. <laughs> you just like spending money, Mike. No, I don't. I do. I do. I guess. <laughs> you do. You know, you, you know got Amazon times, account. You know, yeah, yeah, exactly. You know how many times it's like, 
all my Amazon purchases are like at my door and I already opened them up and I'm like, damn, like I don't have anything coming soon. I feel, oh, like, man, I, you feel like order, I feel like ordering something, you know. <laughs> the only thing I'm waiting on. I'm right surprised now is, you're not watching the home shopping network. No, I, I, even, I, I just ordered part. something earlier. I got that salinity pen coming. It should be here. See, this is where I get spoiled. This is where I get spoiled. I, I look. I, I order something from from BRS, and it's like, oh, five to seven days. But you can spend three bucks, and it'll be there in like guaranteed within five days. So I spend three bucks, but I'm pissed because I'm used to two days shipping from Amazon. Yeah. You get spoils from Amazon real quick. Man, every time I go prime with Amazon, my package always takes seven days. I just cuss them fuckers out. Yo, you know what's sick about where I live, though? Because uh, I, so I'm in Massachusetts, and they they um, within the last like year or year and a half, maybe even two years, there's like a fulfillment center in 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 Massachusetts somewhere now. So, dude, like, it's just random when you when I order stuff with some stuff, like, I order, and it's there the next day, and I'm just, you know, I just, I don't pay anything extra, but because it's so close, I get it, like, the next day, and it, it's not, it's probably, like, 15% of the time, but it's tight, dude, you order something, you're expecting two days, you get the next day. I don't know how, my roommate ordered something at, like, 4 a.m. one night, when, uh, I guess he was laying in bed. He ordered like three, four a.m. and he got it the next day at like like five or six. Yeah, that's because they was processing those orders at the time. Yeah, so that that was pretty, that was pretty cool. But like, you know, it's one of these things where you just get spoiled. You order something, it's there in three days. You're all pissed and like calling them, telling me, you know, you need you need some stuff. So, Mike, when you gonna start making your orders? You ordering what? anything from SC Reefa and uh, Trish? Yo, give me time, bro. Don't, yo, don't Man, step on, don't call me out already. Go ahead. Bro. My, 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 my thing's go ahead. Get your game up, man. You need to get your game up. Oh, I'm about to get mine up. You better get your game May, up. Made it. Made it. May the 11th. My tank gonna be stacked, son. Yeah, Mister. All I do is name brand. <laughs> nah. It ain't like that, nah, you know. I buy what I can afford. So that it's hard to keep up with like like designer name oh, yeah. like it's hard. Definitely. <laughs> it's funny when like I jump in the stream and like somebody's showing their tank and there's like everybody's like, yo, is that a whatever blah blah blah? I'm like, yeah, exactly. And like, oh look at that thing over there. That's a purple people purple people monster lemonade or a <laughs> Aquaculture. I'm like, yeah, yeah. All that together. Could you I'm show a- him the glowing copa pot? <laughs> yeah, right. Somebody said that in the, in the chats earlier. I didn't uh-huh. see that. I guess somebody's like, oh, you-? <laughs> and it was funny because they were they were pumped about it. They're like, yo, did you see them glowing copa pots? I seen them shit. Everybody else was like laughing. I didn't know what they're April Fool's like. Day. That. <laughs> That's just like the blue clownfish. <laughs> Dude, I was thinking about not blue clownfish, but I was thinking about that yesterday on my way home. There's really no green fish in the hobby, huh? Green crawlers. <laughs> yeah, but they're like they're like like a bluish, like turquoise green. Yeah, yeah. yeah you got your parrot fish. I mean, that's a few green ones. You got your green. I grass. want like I want like a lime green. Yellow tang, basically, like a yellow tang, but like lime green. Okay, got now a... you talking about some money? Yeah, I almost bought. You know what I almost bought yesterday? I almost bought a red scooter bunny. Yeah, they cool. I, have... I almost bought a like, gym I... tang. Oh, the red... Is the red scooter? Oh, there you go. The uh, there are... you go. Talking, I'm broke, and he's about to buy a gym tang. Get man, the here. store had him for five hundred dollars, man. Mm. That's not bad though. Nah, that was a deal. Uh, uh, method uh, uh, method said, uh, "Let me back up." He says uh, he's still running the WP twenty five J bone WP ten, the first styles. Yeah, the like first editions. Now, yeah. now for backup. He changed to gyres, and he's been fortunate with J bone products. His return pump's been running for over a year now. Uh, method, dude. I have nothing bad to say about Jabo. 
except customer service. And like I'm, I'm in I'm in retail, so like customer service goes a long way. I mean, like if I reach out to you and you don't get back to me, I won't buy anything from you again. Nope. That's just like I don't know if you I don't know if you guys have like or are you know I, obviously people in here watch some of my videos, but like I I bought those LED like Folger can like big ass lights. They're like they're like this and like yeah I big lights. Yeah, so I bought them and like before I bought them, I reached out to the the, the company on Amazon. I was like, yo, I didn't see no review videos. All I see is like one or two videos on like what they can do. Like you're just like showing. You're just like showing like the like what they can actually do. Like you know, you can turn them up and turn them down. But I haven't seen any review videos. I was like, first off, I was like, hey, would you be interested in like cutting me a deal? I'll buy some. Just cut me a deal. I'll do an unboxing. I'll do a review. Like they didn't get back to me. So then, like three weeks later, I'm like, hey, you know, I'm still interested in these. Can you answer some of my questions? I got some questions about par and like and like controllability. It never got back to me. I bought them anyway, stupidly. I bought them anyway. I bought two of them. They were like one. They were like one thirty a piece or one forty. So like for the money, that's not bad, especially if they work. Um, and then like shortly after I bought them, they they answered my email like, "Hey, just seen this email. Sorry, we didn't get back to you earlier." <laughs> and that was it. Like you're not going to answer any of my questions or none of that. You're just going to say sorry. So I ended up returning those. That's not what with the AF primes, but. I'll uh, can't wait to get the AI problems. I, I need to build a canopy before I do anything because the canopy dictates. Should have got hydras. Okay, yeah, Mister Gem Tang, get out of here with that. Should have got two hydras. Hydras are stupid expensive, bro. I would have doubled my investment. No, because you just wouldn't have needed two. Yeah, and they're what six hundred a piece. I spent six hundred on no, three. No, they they like three three twenty each. Yeah. Yeah, but also I actually went with the AIs because the spread. If you get more of them. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I got the AI. They, they. I, I, I don't got nothing bad to say about those lights. You nah. Know, click, clack. Aren't you Mister AI Prime? Yes, I am that Mr. guy. Mister AI Prime on. Yeah. What are you talking about? I'm pretty I mean, sure you like run the AI Prime Facebook group. <laughs> Yeah, I am the originator. Exactly. So how are you going to talk me out of AI Primes? I just talked you into some Hydra. I mean, AI products. It's AI. Um, what I'm going to do is... AI too, right? Yeah. Yeah. When I, when I get up and running, I, I'm, I'm going to have to, like, jump into that. Because I, I, I never post it. I read some of this stuff. But, like, I don't know what schedule to use. So I'm going to have to, like, hit you guys up for that because I, I don't have a clue. I don't, a, lot, I don't a lot of people, a, a lot of core growers, they got the Hydra, too. The guy I, I see over here, he got the Hydra. Well, a lot of people have like the XRs too, like the XR yeah, fifteen. Yeah. So that is stupid yeah. money. Yeah, the but store, I the don't see I was at yesterday. The store I was at yesterday probably had like I don't even know what tanks they are, but they're probably four foot wide by eight feet by just like they're shallow, like ten inches, twelve inches. But they had probably, if I had to guess, six of them in the middle. With uh, two uh, two XR thirties on each of them, and on the outside they had one, two, three, four, five, six, six more on the outsides with thirties on them, and then whatever lighting they had on these little fish tanks. But like, dude, that was probably like two, four, six, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty, twenty four XR thirties. Like, aren't them bitches like stupid expensive? Hey, later, Davis. Thanks, yep. thanks for joining us. You're looking at what, 600 a light? I don't know. I, I mean, 800. That's crazy. That, I will never. Some people are like, yeah, I'm 800. Sitting, 800. I'm setting up a reef I mean, if you got the money, you know, but it's like, and, and, then you, and then you got to buy the, the connectors and stuff. All yeah, that how to, extra. You, you got to buy like the, the not reef link, but basically the same thing, right? To, to ba- basically control them. Reef link. Yeah. Yeah. What are you doing right there? For me? Yeah. Is that a grinder? Oh. Hand grinder. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. Like, um, you see these people are like, I'm setting up a reef tank. And, like, like 
yeah, there's people watching my videos that think I spent a ton of money, but then you see these other people who are like buying the big boy Apex, buying four XR thirties. They got the the they got like every attachment for the for the Apex. It's like they're setting up like a hundred and twenty five gallon tank and they're putting like twenty grand into it on like I, I, I don't know how people do it. But but what do you do when all of that apex fail you and your system crash? So I don't, run, on it. I don't run everything off the apex, and that's just because I don't want to buy modules. But like the only really, I mean, so I don't run everything right now. I have on my apex. And I'll show you. I'll show you guys. Um, so I don't have a whole lot on my apex. Uh, I think I got it up and running, so let me get this out of here. Let me do this. I don't have to mess with it later. Come on now. All right, either way. All right, so here is... So my Apex, I only run a couple things off of it. I think I got a couple open ones, too. Got my Kimura, uh, my Fuge Light I just set up, which I need to figure it out, dude. I went on my Fuge Light and I set it up. When I go to auto and have the Apex do it for me, it just shuts off. So I don't get it yet. Um, if you guys are seeing this temperature, I I had the temp probe drooped into my display and it was running low. Um so when I put it in my sump, or let me back up. So when I, my, my sump was like super hot. Or let me back up. So my, my, my main display was good. But when I moved my, my temperature probe down to my sump, my sump was warm enough. But my display tank was like a, like a degree, a degree and a half off. So I actually upped it to, to stay. It's like, it's like 70 77 or 78 but to 79 and that keeps my d display around like 77 basically like so i had to do some calculations so when you see this 79 that's my that's my fuse right now my so your ph is 12 no my, my no my ph my ph isn't up so my ph has never been changed I, my pH probe isn't isn't active right now because I'm going to use wow. it for my calcium reactor, but I don't have. Uh, from what I'm told, I need I have the seven and ten calibration uh, solution. Yeah, you need so, the four. Yeah, I need the four. So I haven't bothered setting my pH up yet. But right now, right now, I have my Kimura, uh, my Kimura on there, my Fuge Light, my return pump, my heaters, skimmer, ATO. This isn't even used. And my my calcium reactor pump, like I still have one open outlet, and I don't even know what this is right here. I don't have my my emails are on auto. I still got an old school reef keeper. You know what I use it for? Feed mode. I did feed mode a the other day <laughs> for the first time. I don't use any of like the measurements or logs or none of that. I bought I bought a webcam so I could so I can use it right here, but I haven't set that up yet. I don't use my apex for to its potential. I mean, you see some apexes where it's like this whole area is set up with stuff. It's like you have to like scroll down to see all the stuff. Like I, don't, I, I guess like my lights are going to be ran off of one of the surge like Wi-Fi surge protectors, like. I don't know. I basically really want it for like temperature, uh, pH, and I want it for this stuff. Like everything else, I, I don't care. I mean, why would you? Well, if you just want to put it on a surge protector, but your your lights are Wi-Fi. You're gonna be using them through your phone and Bluetooth, oh, you're right. So you're right. I've never used AI Prime, so they'll be on the app, right? Yeah. Is it hard to? Is it difficult to run um, to run like multiple lights off the same app? No, nah. You just program program it, and it's ready to go. You have one the parent, and one to be the child, 
or however many you got as a child. All right. So anybody in the comments, if you could help me out real quick, I don't understand this. So my my fuse light is set to on. So it's so as of yesterday, it's been run running. Uh, it's it's a run been running for over twenty four hours. So when I go here. Um, hey Mike, to, you need to yeah. present yourself. They can't see it. Have I not been presenting myself? No, you got me. You got this this beautiful guy presented to everybody. Pretty sure I clicked this screen share. Why was that not screen share? So anybody in the comments, sorry guys, anybody in the comments. So here is my, uh, my fuge light. So it's fall back on, you know, set off. This is where I went to advanced. Um, how do I get back to it? Advanced. And basically if time is 20, which is 8 PM, yeah, uh, hold on. If time twenty to eight thirty, then on. Yeah. So between eight p.m. and eight thirty a.m., then on. But it doesn't. If I if I switch, if I switch this over to auto, it turns it turns it off. I don't understand why. Sound like a job for roofing them with the. O. There's a few people. K Tile. So right here on time. Let's try this again. So it's set for 24 hours, right? So I just tried to like set something up. Tyler, you still think that's real? <laughs> No, no glow in the dark pods, man. <laughs> what is uh, in the comments? What is hyster hysteresis? Hysteresis? What is that? I don't know what that means. What does that mean, guys? What is it? Hysteresis or hysteresis? This right here. What does that mean? Well, in my language... <laughs> we don't want to know about your language. <laughs> kind of sound like it's scared. <laughs> DSR, what's up, buddy? Uh, I don't. I'm still new to this, man. I don't got a clue. I'm just trying. So, if anybody in the chat knows with, with hyster, hysteresis or hysteresis, what, what does that mean? Why is it set at one o'clock or one? So, I got it set. Let me save that. Let me save this. You still got clips, though. <laughs> no, not on my screen. On my, phone it's show, on my phone, it's showing me presented. Yeah. yeah. I see you, too. Yeah. All right, so if I go to this, let me run out there and see if it stays on. I'll be right back. Yeah, it's presented. Man, I cracked this thing, man. It's on. It's on right now. That's cool. Cause I was messing with it for a minute last night and it wasn't on. See, Mike, why you sitting there playing with all your gadgets and gadgets? 
I'm growing coal. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm setting myself up. <laughs> I don't even know what link A29, link A210. Listen to what you said. You setting yourself up. Try to. Hope not for failure. So I could go out there and show you what's going on, but it's like there's so much noise out there. I don't know why they're still out there watching. They got a 12-year-old out there, and they're trying to finish a movie. Come on. Keep it simple, boy. Keep it simple. All I don't right. think you ready for all, all right. this shit. All right, yo, you run your soft coral tank, all right? And then... <laughs> I'll get there, man. Let me let me do my own. I got a lot of a couple people like, yo, why are you running a calcium reactor? Why are you doing this? Why? Because I'm I'm let me figure it out. All right, Mike. You got plenty of money to blow. No, I don't. Wish I had plenty of money to blow. I'd certainly have a house of my own. Oh man, I'm working on that now. What a headache. What are you working on? A house. It's a lot of money, man. <clears throat> a lot of money. It's a headache. You, you ever bought a house before? Yeah. Have you? So you don't use your first time home buyer up? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do. I've, I mean, because I've never used a first time home buyer, I'm thinking about buying like a two or three family. Mm. Writing a couple out, I don't know. Yeah, we thinking about building from scratch. Oh, really? <clears throat> I heard that's even harder. Uh, not money wise, but like the stress of actually building your own house, like trying to figure out what you want to do with it, how you want to do it, what you want to do with the kitchen, how you want the layout. Yeah. I heard it's really hard. Yep, pretty much a headache. Especially when you deal with a woman. I'm gonna text my roommate and say, "What the f are you guys doing out there?" I don't think I can. Give me one second. Are you listening? I'm still on the call. I'm still on the call. We're Right, I'm back. Jesus. Drama these. So I'm just going to wait for AI to make a, a return pump. And uh, I'm going to run everything. AI. That way I don't need to control. I can control everything from my phone. Uh, can you hear me? Yeah. Yeah. I hear you. Okay. 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 You're making sure. You're making sure. I'm still in the building. Oh, I think I'm done. Putting a band aid to that tank. I'm surprised Mike didn't get them XR15s though. Yeah, he's get spending here, all his money. <laughs> get it, Mike. <laughs> yep. Dude, I wish, man. I can't. I can't pull that. I guess I could put it on credit, but I ain't trying to do all that. Put it on credit. Yeah. Damn, Mike. I would think, and I would have bought you a couple of them AIs. They had them on sale at my fish store for $100. Nah. Hundred bucks. Yep. You serious, right, bro? Yeah, and they had a three-year anniversary. Nice. Uh, outlet yeah. seven on eight thirty two energy bar covers three programs. Next time you get, where, where's that at? Where Rock. you do? I'm in North Carolina. I'm in Raleigh. Oh, okay. Yeah, I would have sent you the money to catch up, and you would have sent it to me. You know. Yeah, I I posted the sale nice. on my Facebook page for yeah. all my friends that wanted you know the shop. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. Gotcha. No one ever. 
<laughs> contacted me about it, so I thought somebody yeah. would hit me up about them five hundred dollar gym chains. Yeah, yeah, hell yeah, that was that was sweet. The Achilles was seventy five. Nah, wow, that's crazy. Achilles was seventy five bucks. Buy me one. The sale is over with now, Mike. Uh, when's the next one? Uh, <laughs> next year, <laughs> the four year sale. <laughs> is there was a three year or uh, uh, the six year mark now. <laughs> Whoa, that's a pretty good sale, bro. Oh yeah, mm-hmm. that's yeah, some killer out. deals. They was even fragging the display tank. There was what? Wow. They was fragging from the display tank. Oh, really? Yeah. If they do that, they needed to pay some bills then. Nah, they they was just getting a lot of stuff out of stock. They're a franchise yeah. store. They uh okay, okay. Fantastics. Oh, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, so that's how they get the uh, deals by mm-hmm, having all mm-hmm. those stores and franchises. Yeah, yeah. Wow. I don't know. I mean, I'd be too scared to buy a gem tag. I mean, that's a lot of money. Man, that's a lot. Mm-hmm. Especially if it's it like is. not guaranteed. Like, yeah, you know, you don't, yeah. you don't know. I mean, you could buy a fish. You could buy a like a. You could buy something stupid, and it would like last through a bunch of tank crashes. Yeah, like some dumb shit. But then you buy. A five hundred dollar fish and you can't get it through quarantine. You five <laughs> buy a five hundred dollar fish and you can't get it through acclimation. You know. Yep. Yep. And the thing is, every fish that I bought from this store never lived, so <laughs> oh. I don't buy fish <laughs> there anymore. <laughs> yeah. Now, they got sticks galore. I mean, they had like a five dollar stick sale last week. Awesome, yo, yo, hit me up when they have sales. <laughs> Yeah, they do a weekly sale every Friday. I post it, post it to my Facebook. Yeah, let me know too. Got some sticks for the tank. My next they... purchases, like I mean, outside of livestock, I think my next purchases would be like, um, I think I want like a leak detector. Uh, an apex leak detector and then I think I want probably that that um, probably leak detector and that uh, blood guardian I think I'm going to buy that actually. I like that thing that will be a good one other than that I don't have um, Jerome says there's a six hundred dollar gem tang here uh, for us in the local reaper. It's still pricey. But yeah, I, I I agree. Yeah, I want a blotched Anthias. Me too. Uh, those blotched Anthias, Billy, I think ordered a couple. His uh, he had his local fish store order them. I don't know. I feel like if I, spending like 60 or 80 bucks on a fish is like a lot for me. So spending like that kind of money is like absurd. All right, guys, what time is it? I'm getting tired. <clears throat> All right, I'm going to call yeah, it a Starting to get low. Um, What's up? You calling it? Uh, well, uh, well, we'll do another 13 minutes. Yeah. Do it at midnight. I got to work. I got to be to work at 830. So if I get to bed soon, yeah. which I probably will, I'm getting a little tired. Uh, you know, a few hours, you know, six, seven <laughs> hours of sleep should be all right. Yeah. Click clack said, "Wife me made me shut up." I hear you, Shy Town. You still there, bro? Yep. <laughs> Damn, G. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm listening. Yeah, I hear you. Maybe I'll even call you. What do you guys think? You you about ready? No, I'm good. See you. Do you hear me? I hear you, bro. Yeah, hear okay. You. Let you hear me. <laughs> I'm here contemplating the tank. The crack tank. Yo, fill it up, bro. <laughs> right? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Let's see what happens. You want to see it? No, I, I, wouldn't want you, I wouldn't want you to mess it up for no reason. Yeah. Nah, I'll wait. I'll wait. I'll give it some time to heal a little bit, you know, and see what happens tomorrow. And this so what are you gonna put in the that right way? Huh? What are you gonna put in that thing? Some sand, some chino, and and the and the, uh, the, no, the horses. No, no, no. My, my 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 thing was right. Um, I was gonna the seven and a half. Basically, was gonna be this tank right here. So basically, get everything out of the seven and a half and put in this one. Then have the seven and a half as a display refugio. Smaller one, Click you know, because I don't want to. Click like said, we're gonna we're gonna make Calypso start a big tank. <laughs> That's for real. Let's let's oh, get it cool. going. I got that one there sitting down and about sixty gallons. I know. What are you waiting on? Nah, because I don't like with all this craziness going on here in the house. I don't want to set it up, and then I gotta. Because the, the landlords, supposedly, they they planning to sell the house. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I moving, wanna... moving, a, moving a 75 stock, dude, I, I hated it. Oh, well, tell me t- about it. I moved, um, my 75, it went from here to Maryland. Yeah, why did that, I would never. I'd sell it I off took, and start over. I took the water and everything, bro. Crazy. <laughs> Yeah. Would you move to move to Maryland and back? Yeah. Yeah, when I moved down there, it's still over there. Um my ex still got it. In the basement now. Reef tank? Huh? Still got your reef tank? Yeah. But there's nothing in there no more. She gave everything to to the LFS over there and she just kept the tank in the basement. For whenever I feel like going down there and get it. You think I I'm gonna go down there and get it for I get a new one? For a seventy five? Yeah, seventy five. Is it drilled? Nah, not the same one. I mean, not the same one you got though. Yeah, the Maryland. I think. It yeah, is. you probably Maybe. spend the same on gas to get there and back. Yeah. Especially yeah. when Petco's got the dollar per gallon, they're only ninety bucks. Yeah, and now they got those. I mean, I like the because it had the black or oh, silicone. You know, it looked at nice. Mine does too. Yeah, so they they look nice with the black silicone. But, All right, I think I'm gonna call. It. I'm tired. It's about yeah, go ahead, bro. I'm okay. It's getting a little stale. People leaving, so I'm gonna call it. Uh, right. So, man, as always, I appreciate you coming. Chi Town, you okay. can come right. too. Exactly. I appreciate Thank you for having me. Everybody in the chats, Chi it's been fun. Uh, I don't know. Later. I don't know when I'll do it again, but it'll happen. It'll just be a random live stream. So we'll see what's up. Uh, but y'all come back now. You here? Okay. I right, apologize, oh. you guys. <laughs> Chat. Peace out. Oh, my it was brother. a pleasure. All right, later, guys. <laughs>